All right, so hi YouTube. I'm doing a eight game Resident Evil Marathon RE1, one remake two, two remake three, Code Veronica, Survivor, and Outbreak. Every time I get bit by a zombie, so grabbed and then bit, I will gift a sub to chat. And every time chat gifts, what is the number? Every time chat gifts tw 20 subs, I will take damage, unless I'm one hit from death. And if I die, I'll give 25, so I'll add 25 to the counter. <laughs> <laughs> you get the idea. And I'm moving on to the next game. But we won't die. We won't die in any game. It is loud, is but I can't turn it down. Wow. What a mansion. Thank you, Yan, for the raid. Captain Wesker, where's Chris? Stop it. Don't open that door. But Chris is. What is it? One sec, I need to turn this up. Maybe it's Chris. Now, Jill, can you go? I'm, I'm going, going with you. you. Chris, Chris is, is our, our old partner, partner, you know. Okay. Thank you, Genesis. Let me handle this. Thank you, Aurora. Stay alert. Not a randomizer? What is this? A dining room. What? what? What is, is this? this? What is it? Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Hope this is not Chris's blood. Oh no, it's in English. Oh my god, I have the quick turn on. That's okay, I won't use Barry? it. I didn't know it was on. That's the only time you back up in the entire game. Watch out! It's a monster! Let me take care of this. What is it? Kenneth was killed too. Maybe by this creature. Anyway, let's report this to Wesker. You guys hear that beef? Wesker! Wesker! Help me look for him, Jill. Thank you, Gutsy Chat Monkey. For the time being. Find anything in that corner there, Jill? For that split second there, Jill? Find anything, Jill? Nothing. Jill goes into the corner of a room for a split Can't second. Find anything, Jill? Beats me, too. Yeah, no, Barry, I found Wesker. There's a I thing of treasure back there. On. Well, I found a lock can't pick. Be helped. Let's search for him separately. I'll check the dining room again. Okay, I'll try the door on the opposite side. This mansion is gigantic. We could get into trouble if we get lost. We, we should, should start, start from, from the first floor, floor okay? okay? And, and Joe, Joe, here's a cock pick. It might be handy if you, the master of unlocking, take it with you. Thank you, Papega Trash. Maybe I'll need it. A cockpick, yes. You use that to get the lint Listen, out of the if something happens, little hole in the tip of your Let's meet up in this hall. Hall. This time I'll be there. Oh, that's so sickening. Should have said that. Oh god. I can't cope. Let's see if I remember how to even play a non-rando. I was thinking a remake. I was thinking a remake. Okay. Oh my god. All right, English text. There, I complained about it for the last time. All right, now I'll shut up.
Wait yeah. a sec. No. There. I was thinking of Chris. My inventory is scuffed right now. So the reason you fill up your inventory here... Somebody wrote this in blood. Jesus! Ah! Alright, King Henry Dodge. Thank you, Enigma, for the five Jill. gifted subs. What's going Thank on? you. Alright, keep track of that guy's five. No, but something's wrong with this house. Whoa. Whoa. This hall is dangerous. Maybe it's better to secure our escape route first. There must be a back door somewhere. The reason you fill your inventory is... Let's try to find it first, shall we? Right here. Usually, he's like... Oh, here... I, I have this. You know that whole cutscene? He doesn't do it if your inventory's full. And you don't need that ammo, so... Oh my god, it's been so long since I ran this game. Look, <gasps> legit. Thank you, chicken. Thank you so much for the five good subs. That's ten. Ten more, and I will take damage from whatever's in front of me. But don't bother, guys, because it's not going to stop me. Ten from Sleep Monster. Thank you so much. All right, first zombie. And thank you, Jokers, for the five. All right. God, everything is so loud. This way. Uh, <laughs> so... Okay, now we're back at five. All right, keep, let's keep driving like that. I've redeemed the tw the first 20, and now we're back at five. Where the fuck am I? Thank you, Sleep Monster, and thank you, Joker's Lackey. Thank you, Papa Robe and Glass back. Yeah, so now we're at five again. But don't bother gifting subs, because you guys aren't going to kill me. It's just there as an incentive. The only way to kill me in an RE game is to get me in danger in a very in very specific spots. And no one knows where they are. Thank you, Namad, for the 22. Who, 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 thank you, who, who. Yeah, I can't wait for that. I can't wait to be killed at the end of RE2 original. Like, one footstep away just to gift an extra 25 subs. Thank you, Dante. And thank you, Formidable Frog. Thank you so much. The 88. Holy fuck. Holy balls. Oh, look at Maxi Lobes, look! You see the picture of him? Look, look, quick! That's Maxi, a fellow streamer. I don't know how he snuck his way into this game, but he's there. It looks exactly like him. It looks exa- like... His second coming. Well, his second coming is Maxi Lobes. His first coming. Oh, Jill. Richard! 
What happened? Oh, Jill, this house is dangerous. There are, there are terrible, terrible demons. demons. Ouch! You're wounded. What kind of demon attacked I know about you? all Maxie's comings. It was a huge snake and also poisonous. Poisonous? No. Richard, hold on. There is serum. Oh, no. Oh, no. I should have brought some with me. No problem. I'll go and get it. Thanks. I haven't been to the room where it is yet. He hasn't told me where it is. But watch, Jill is half cyborg in canon. Look. Scanning. Bill knows exactly where it is. All right, we're gonna say hi to Maxi. Hey, Mr. Lopes. Looking good. Looking good. I'm sad we we can't get a good time in this run since I'm on English. <laughs> Cuz it is vastly slower. Well, I can't get a good time anyway, but okay. I forget if you visit the bank. Oh, you definitely do. All right. You definitely do. Oh, uh, sorry, I forgot. No more complaining about English text. Richard, oh. hold on. I'll give you a shot, shot now. now. Jill, here's my radio. You should keep it. I. When did I change the smash emote? No, Richard. Keep looking. Jill, I changed most of the emotes. I've gifted for every English text complaint. All right, deal. Well, starting now. Uh oh. Oh god. This is the hardest dodge in the whole game. It uh, uh, seems like a uh, seems like I'm joking, but it actually is. <laughs> oh, okay, I can't. I was gonna say something, but I can't. <laughs> Italian is a beautiful language. This isn't locked. Picture of a newborn baby. And he pressed it. Thank you, Eddie, for the gifted sub. That's six. Thank you. 
He really pushed it. That's an RE4 quote. Except it's she really pushed it. A middle-aged man. That ain't us. Here I am. A bald-looking old man. Will you push it? Sure. I guess so. Bing. Bing. I gotta pee so bad. No, we can't pee until the job is done. Just go! Don't worry about us. No! Yes. This is called quick crank. But slightly slower. Because I failed it. The only glitch in minor glitches. Or well, I guess pause cancel is a glitch. I guess I, I can explain the runs for those who are new to- Or I should say I guess. Uh, like, you know, uh, Usually it's everyone knows, but, um... So, if you shoot a weapon in this game, and then pause right after you shoot... Okay. When you hit with a weapon- Thank you, Resident Alligator. Thank you, Princess Linky. When you shoot a weapon in RE1, you have to- Your character, like, gets into an animation to aim it, and then when you shoot, you unaim the weapon. If you pause after shooting, there is no unaim animation. So you save a fraction of a second where you can run. But the kicker is, and this is where it comes in handy a lot of the time in the run, the enemy you shot will still be stuck in the I got shot animation. So he's stuck in the animation, you're not. So you just run by. This bathtub is filled with shit. You wanna unplug it? Sure. Fuck it. Thank you, Bludgy. One of my favorite- okay guys, keep an eye on chat. One of my favorite parts about doing this marathon is every time I'm hit by anything that isn't a zombie, at least 4,000 people will be like, Hey, you didn't count that one. You know, next time I do this, I'm doing all damage. All damage. You gotta do it, Zero. You gotta do it now. Now that it's in that big old brain. Dude, dude. Sub to Bakba. Sub to Bakba. That doesn't work anymore. I'm just gonna shut up. Sub to Bakba! Sub to Bakba! Yeah! <clears throat> um, thank you, George W. Kush, for the 10 gifted subs! Thank you, Goblin Thief 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 Goblin Thief Ashley! Thank you! Uh, thank you, my Karuba, uh, uh, for the free sub. Thank you, Dash! Uh, thank you, Bledgy! Uh, okay, I need to take damage from the next enemy. And we're at four gifted subs to the next one after that. Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, I want to thank you, 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 and you. Thank you, and, th and you. Thank you, Mighty Couscous. I'm going to need this for once. Look at this. Got him. Thank you. No, no, okay. Slow down. No more of that. Thank you, veteran. 
Wait, you can't get one shot by the shark, can you? Oh, oh, oh thank you, Saren. Okay, okay, stop. Yeah, are you okay? All right, that's one. I owe you guys two or three or. Oh, stop! Stop! Back it, I'm here. Yeah, are you okay? I owe you guys a few hits. Don't one shot me. I don't think you can unless you're in danger. <laughs> I think I. I think I owe one more. <laughs> this is like a eat my leg, you asshole. at thank you sorry thank you better thank you mighty goose goose thank you plenty thank you Ashley. thank you george w kush guys they're subbing to bakba grab your mom's credit card put it in the twitch app sub to bakba put the card back don't tell daddy <laughs> Don't actually do that. That was a joke ski. <laughs> Take dad's credit card. It's up to Bakba again. Thank you, Saren. 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 Thank Thank you, Lobo. I'll get bit by this guy. Ah! No, 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 no. Ah! Stupid hour you fucking won and you take multiple bites for one bite. I'm going pee. Don't mention it. What a monster. I can't believe... What the hell is this place anyway? Like it's nothing. Wesker! <sighs> Back on three, all right. Jill, Wait. so you're safe. That's what she was gonna say. That's what I was going to say. Where on earth have you been? You disappeared from the hall all of a sudden. Bean. I'm sorry, but I have. She said it reasons. like the legume. Perhaps you guys have met them. It was all I could do to protect myself against those strange creatures. Bean. Is that right? Anyway, it's good to see you're safe. Baked beans. Jill, our first priority is to get. She made out it funny. Yeah, she said yes, bean. You're right. Now there are a lot of beans in that mansion. That we can't get into because they're locked up. I have been looking around for clues. Clues. Okay. Clue. I'll go to the other house and see if I can find any, any clues. clues. Will you do that? I'm counting on you. See if I can find any clues. Alright, let's go look for some clues. Shall we? Wait, do we need the silver key? I don't remember. Damn it. Watch this. Damn it. 
Wait. I don't remember what I'm doing. Thank you, Carelock. This is the only Resident Evil where you don't actually run slower in caution or danger. It's the last day of September, guys. October is tomorrow. Well, you run faster in RE2. And then slower in danger. But your movement speed doesn't change at all in RE1. Let's go. No, I didn't mean to press that button. Don't skip what? You talk about the hunter cutscene? Sorry. Let's go. You can't skip cuts. <laughs> oh, you guys see that dodge? Sorry. Brad, stop. Thank you, silent player. Thank you, silent player. Thank you, silent player. Thank you, silent player. It's too dark to see anything. Watch this Barry. Find anything interesting? Should I find anything, Jill? Jill, have you found anything interesting? Here, Neon in it. Yes, but I can't see. There is well. a How about smoldering going down pile of like eight ton goop. I have a rope here. Steaming up oh, his butthole gee. right now. Well, then I'll try to go and he down doesn't using notice the rope. anything interesting. Wait. Wait. All right, should we save? Ba Since you guys have been so generous, we'll save Barry. How about that? But we're not saving Chris because that's already ripped. Hey, what's going on? Now he's done it. How I've done it. Sorry, Jill. Wait. Oh, I'll go, go and get, get another, another rope. The rope. Barry. The rope he threw down there is clearly spoiled. Instead of throwing it back up, he has to go get a fresh rope. Who's gonna touch a used rope? Wait, Barry, I can just throw it back up to you. Well. Thank you, Failmore. Failmore in the chat. Thank you for the 55 months. Barry's back! Hey! Are you there, Jill? Grab the rope! Grab the rope! Grab the rope! Grab the rope! Thank you, Kooky. I'm sorry, Jill. I didn't know that was going to happen. Sorry. I was really careless. Are you okay, Barry? Maybe you're getting tired. No, I'm all right. Don't worry. Um, thank you, Double Dax. Jill, thank you, thank you. I found something. <sighs> thank you. I'll take this then. And Barry saved. That is how you save Barry. You wait for him to come back. You get that cutscene, and bada bing, bada boom, you've saved him. Ah! <laughs> Who's this asshole? No, 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 you know, I used to not count those bites in RE1 because RE1 zombies always bite you multiple times, those bastards. Well, you can get a one biter, but no.
Yeah, Valmar. Where's RE3 Remake? Buddy? Got some bad news for you. I'm not playing it. Yo, but P rounds. Well, I don't want to spoil it for the rest of you guys. You should all go buy it and play it. It's well worth the money. And the good news is it's almost as long as separate ways if you like that. Mario Wonder? I wonder what that game's gonna be like, but don't ask me. It comes out in October. You're asking the wrong guy. I'll be busy with my horror games. Mario can go stick it. He can go stick it up his own butthole. Thank you, Giraffe, for the 60 tizzle. For the 60 tizzle. How about a song, uh, Mario? What do you say? For old time's sake. What good, good timing. timing. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. Let's go together since it's dark and we can't see very well. Okay. okay Alright, watch it. Listen closely, okay. guys. Then I'm gonna cover I'm you. gonna cover you. Let's hurry. Let's hurry. Hey. Hey, are you alright? I, I could can go, go first, first if you want me to. I can go first if you want me to. No. Okay. Let's go, Barry. I'm depending on you. I could go first if you want me to. Okay. Nice shooting, Tex. Holy shit! Enrico! Is that Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? Yeah. Yeah? You're alive! Wait there! Wait there! Are you with anybody, Jill? What? Oh, yes. Enrico! So, Barry and Jill together. Are you alright, Enrico? The stars are doomed. Someone is a traitor. Everything was plotted from the start by Umbrella. <laughs> Who killed him? 
sounded like Orch. How do you think I've heard that crank sound in my life? That's the craziest thing about this game. Crank cranking a wall with that small ass crank and it moving an entire section of this like concrete area. It's crazier than the zombies. Is it this one? I think it is. Beep, beep, boop, boop. Descend it. Ada. Thank you, Steve and Leon. Steve and Leon. The two best RE characters. Thank you, food for less. Thank you, thank you. Should we try around Jeremy's corner?
try it. Get by. Without a scratch. Oh my god, the trigger for that door is so far left. Fine, fine job, job Barry. Barry. Just as I thought. She knew it. I think you should stay away from Barry, Jill. She knew it the whole I time. I hear his wife and two daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. You are so cruel. Isn't he? Well, you don't have to worry about anything. Because you'll God, be is free cruel. from this world very soon, I hate him. Jill. Why do you have to destroy stars? That's Umbrella's intention. This laboratory has been engaging sick. in dangerous experiments, and recently an accident has occurred. Make me sick. Anyway, this disaster cannot be made public. <sighs> That's why having stars nosing about is so inconvenient. So you're a slave of Umbrella now, along with these virus monsters. I think you misunderstand me, Jill. To me, the monsters you mention mean nothing. Nothing. I'm going to burn all of them together all with of this them. entire laboratory. I must complete my mission as ordered by Umbrella. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Don't go, Barry. Barry! Barry! Barry's such a fool. He'll be under the control of Umbrella forever. How come both Umbrella and you can intimidate him by taking his family as hostages? Umbrella? Well, I intimidated him, but it had nothing to do with Umbrella. I just used him for my personal, personal purposes. purposes. Though both you and Barry seem to think I was following orders from Umbrella. So you're planning something else? If you succeeded in developing the world's most powerful biological weapon, what would you what do? What would you do? What if you were in charge? What would you guys do? You must stop this now. You're a brave girl. But if I were you, I wouldn't give up such a big discovery. You guys are oh, idiots. Fuck. I need my Xbox no controller. No one understands its real value. Or do I? So you're going to steal all the research? <laughs> Better yet, I'm going to show you the tyrant. Oh! <gasps> Sorry, Joe. Who's your family? Uh, I was listening to what you and Wesker were talking about. I wish I realized it Barry earlier. Barry, motherfucking bird. It must have something to do with Umbrella, you know. So it's all been masterminded by him. But it's good that you know that now. They need anyway, to make... Let's get out of this house first. Go, no. Jill. Yes, what? Do you have they need to make any Barry... idea what Wesker was going to show you um, at the back of this place? <clears throat> Well, like he was a talking Kratos about the type figure for all fathers out there. Called weapon, called tyrant or something. I think it's his time. Do you think we could? Even though they did that in Rev Two already. Now, Barry, you're so optimistic. It would look bad for stars if we let such a dangerous creature run, run loose. loose. Maybe you're right. Let's go then. Creature 
creature like this really be the ultimate biological weapon? Really? Really? Wesker is a crazy man. Tyrant is not. The, oh, these cutscenes are canon. Now, there's actually, there's no canon ending. But we can't let it live. And there's no canon ending in the remake either. That must be the computer for monitoring this creature. For monitoring this creature. One has eight endings. Can't control what it does. And none of them are canon. Barry? Barry? You're alive! Uh, 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 I'm rude. Embarrassed. I was yeah, it's a crazy clumsy. fight. Going. Uh, uh. Come on, Barry. What happened to Wesker? The triggering system has now been activated. All researchers and guards should take cover. Wesker must yeah, RE1 off. re remake will have a cannon in there. Barry Burton. will be fine. He has an ability to call it hard where he flexes his muscles like this. Really hard, it focuses. And not even a nuke can hurt him. And that's what he does here when the bomb goes off. He's hardening down there in his jail cell. Chris uses Harden. The bomb explodes, not very effective. Chris survives. That's my head cannon. I need to go find my Xbox controller. I don't even remember what I run remake on.
What's my pause button for the splits? There it is. Oh, I shouldn't pause yet. Just wait. <laughs> I need my controller. Wait up for me, even uh, today, uh, eldest daughter. Uh, I'm sorry. Don't worry about that. I know he must still be alive. Forty-five, fourteen. Oh, uh, shoot. Okay, uh, now we're going to play a little game I like to call uh, Resident Evil. Does anyone, one's in the chat, have you ever heard of that? So it's a game where you basically, you're this person guy or girl whatever and there's bad guys but um those bad guys um uh there's like there's they're infected sort of so um uh and they um uh some of them bite um and uh um it it hurts um and then there's like politicians and like wesker wesker you, he's the bad guy but you don't know he's well i don't want to spoil it but Oh. 
Yeah, Fang? Yo, Rick here. Thank you, Jolly Grim, for the 200 bits again. Thank you, Food for Less. Thank you. And I want you guys to enter the survival horror, if that's okay. Is that okay? Got, co Got cold wiener already? Not like you. Chat, dude. I haven't ran this in a while. Yoink! Shh. Scariest one by far. This game's pretty scary. Yeah. Well, I don't want you guys in the chat to get scared, but October starts tomorrow. Please don't be scared, guys. I want to protect you. For every gifted sub that you guys send for this game in particular, that's one thought and or prayer of your choosing for someone else in the chat. Just because I just want to make this a holy place. If you want to protect the chat, you know. Fucker! No damage! Thank you, my Karuba. Dude. Oh my god! You know what? Every other time, I don't count those. I'll cut it. I'll count it. There. There! I counted it. You guys like my kendo impression? Ah! It's a little more manly, but or I am, I mean. Uh thank you, Mike but thank you, Joker's Lackey. Thank you. That's two people are gonna be safe in the chat. Thank you so much for defending the chat room. That is insanely generous, like, and very thoughtful, too. Who do you guys- actually, you know what, if you give to sub, tell me who you want to protect in the chat. If you want- if you're not comfortable with that, that's okay. See, this is your way, if, if you have a crush in the chat or something, you know, you can, or like a best buddy, you can just tell me who you're protecting. Your cat, okay. Cool. Thank you, Food for Less. You know me. Thank you, Apris. <laughs> the 
defending Rando. No Randos today. Oops. I haven't done like non-randomizers in forever, so some people don't like Randos. That's okay. It's always nice to see the actual game every every now and then. You know what I mean? Let's go. Murder hall time. Easy. Oh my god, that scared me. That footstep, I was like, wait, this is a zombie here? He was a zombie? Yeah. Is that voice Enrico's? Is that voice Richard's? Do I remember how to run this game? We're gonna find out. I think it's this way. Look at that ponytail just swinging in the wind. Oh shit. Uh... See ya! Oh my god, I didn't... Fucking... I didn't... Or my split didn't count for Resident Evil 1. We got it. Oh shit. Whoops. Is this the right way? I think so. Wait, no, 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 no. Oh, wait. Yeah, this way. Oh, thank you, non, non slick. Glad you enjoyed. It was quite the mod. Have I tried the one dangerous zombie mode? Ah, uh, no. Can you explain that to me? You, you fucking piece of. Ah! And here we go. I'm just, I'm just dicking around. There is no such thing as a one zombie mode. That's just like... When you play New Game Plus, Forest is in like two rooms in the game. But there's no such thing as one zombie mode. Or one dangerous zombie. Thank you, Lord Dookie. Thank you, Colpax.
All right. Bang. Thank you, Jimbo. Oops, shit. Those candles are so bent. I hope when they inevitably remake RE1 again that they change the entire mansion. I want a brand new mansion. Here's what they should do with RE1 Re Remake. They should give you a Rebecca scenario and and a Jill scenario and a Chris scenario. All of them are vastly different. And and when you pick Rebecca, it's literally just RE0. Oh, there no! That's not too much to ask, by the way, since RE4 Remake is like twice the size plus of RE1 Remake and Zero. Like more enemies, more locations. Yada yada yada. Oh, the lore is perfect in Zero. Don't know what you're talking about, bro. RE1 definitely has, and Zero in spots too. RE1's, one of its main strengths is its level design. Or this game. Not, what am I, what the fuck am I doing? The mansion in this game is just like one big puzzle for the player to solve. That's why this game is so good. That's why I really like the indie games like Nightmare of Decay and um, what's that one that's really similar to Nightmare of Decay? Have we played? The dev hangs out in chat a lot. Dead Beacon, yeah that's it. Yeah those games are exactly like, they have the RE1 remake. Thing where it's this big open area every time you go up to anything it's a puzzle or like it's a locked door and you need to do a puzzle later on to do it yeah tormented wieners no uh. no 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 wait do you use flame rounds? Wait, do you use flame rounds? Uh, 
I remember doing that menu. I'm pretty sure you do. We got the four shot. Oh, for if it's four shot, you want to use an explosive on the last one. I forgot. That's going to change. Um. Plant 42. Hopefully not much, but. Yeah, why not, Johnny? Why not? Now uh, the next Resident Evil is probably RE9. Why keep remaking? Because, here, I'll give you my reason why they should keep remaking. Because 4 remake, 3 remake, and 2 remake. If they actually took 3 remake serious, 2 remake and 4 remake are far better than Village and 7 in my opinion. Seven only gets, in my opinion, because I know this is a mine. Usually, I have majority opinions for a lot of the Resident Evil stuff, but well, I shouldn't say usually, but a lot of the time. Uh, but uh, regardless, doesn't matter. The only reason I even put se that I think Seven is a game to be argued for is just because of its DLC is so good. And unfortunately, 2, 3, and 4 didn't get the same treatment with DLC. Well. I wish, I wish 2 Remake, 3 Remake, and 4 Remake all had like RE7 tier DLC. RE7 has fucking god tier DLC. Two huge story ones, one big puzzle. One little fun mini game, one like challenge, uh, like challenge arena, and then an actual challenge mode. Like, oh man. And then there's the 21, and then there's the other story, the whole story one. There's so much, there's so much DLC for seven. I don't know why they went so hard on that and then just skimped out completely on, uh, three, skimped out on two and then we got separate ways for four but I mean that was sort of a guaranteed thing but I guess the answer is probably that the R7 DLC didn't sell as much as they wanted it to so they didn't do it anymore Yeah, well, Metal Gear Cheese, I mean, yeah, like, I only loved, like, the Bedroom DLC is really good. That's just, like, a big puzzle, and I love that. Um, End of Zoe's God tier, I love that one, too. But, like, it's not like I hated the other ones. Like, I, I like Not a Hero, I don't love it, but I think Not a Hero's okay. But it's, like, it's still, I'm glad it exists, and I had fun playing it. I played it a couple times. Uh, and same with, um... Same with like the Nightmare DLC. I thought that was fun. I only played it once. And um I love Ethan Must Die though. That's my favorite one. <laughs> I love Ethan Must Die. It's so unforgiving. It's so good. Just like fuck the player. I love stuff that's like fuck the player. I love getting fucked. In game.
All right, I hope my zero brain waves got me this far without getting stuck. Okay. Um, oh, do it! I think I was supposed to go in this room. Never mind. Should have listened to my my muscle memory. Okay, that's re one o o g. This is remake. Thank you, Shea Blaze. Pretending, eh? All right, that's it, mods. Oh. I'm just kidding. Oh my god. <laughs> Sub to Bakba. <laughs> Thank you, young Tom Cruise. Thank you. Up to Bakba. Young Tom Cruise, Young Tom Cruise, going in, thank you so much. Thank you, Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise is in the chat. Fucking crazy. Boing. Place your bets, guys. It's gonna be one, two, or three. Unknown source of pressure detected. Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Oh shit! You guys better be right. Two. I've seen a lot of twos. Seen a lot of twos. Of Who said two? Fucking. Who said three? Where are my ones at? Where are my ones at? Where are my ones at? Thank you guys. They knew. Thank you ones. Thank you, thank you. Well, well, well. Oh, that guy over there. Stop 
Gamer! Thank you for the five good subs. Thank you. Are you okay? I have no mods on, no. Thank you, McDennis. Charity. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Stumper. What a number are we at now for bites? By the way, I'll mix it up for RE2 Original. Thank you, Edmonton. This is the worst zombie in the game. He gave us the good luck. Hell yeah, dude. Thank you, Queen Teapot. Yeah, Stumper Gamer. Yeah, it's nice to stream and do the marathon today. I wasn't actually going to do the marathon today. I was going to do it tomorrow. Um... I've had a lot of YouTube videos on the back burner I want to do. Um, and some October stuff I wanted to set up, but I realized last night before I went to bed that September ends tonight. So I was like, well, what's the point of doing a subathon after <laughs> after the event ends? Wait. This isn't enough ammo, but... Piece of shit, fucking plant, piece of fucking, fucking plant shit, fucking. I'm not. Yes, slash. By the way, guys, if you didn't notice yet, there are new um, October emotes. A lot of the emotes got a little a facelift. I still have some more to add, but we got some. We got some. Do -do. Do -do -do -do. There they are. There they are. You know what's funny? Bokgasm? That's that emote has been gone for a while. The Twitch took it down. But it's allowed because there's no saliva. Since it's blood, it's allowed. But if it's saliva, it's not. Man. What a world we live in. Sex, bad, violence, good, yep. Oh, I already have one. Sexy violence. Ooh. Damn, girl. All right, here we go. Shh. 
I hate this part. If you can't stair skate fast enough here, you die. <laughs> or you hope you get lucky with your grenade shots. Oh yeah, we don't even need to get into it. It's it's a dumbass rule. I mean, Bach butt, Bach butt isn't allowed. But since there's a bite taken out of his butthole, and he's purple, it's allowed now. You know, it's dumb as hell. Yeah, they're biased towards purple. That is it. <laughs> I don't know if we have enough ammo. Like, I just can't remember, because I'm... I'm rusty as hell. I think we do. Pretty sure eight's like more- way more than enough, but I'm just... I'm missing something. I was so waiting for this door to be like, lock. Why do I have so much extra inventory space? I thought your inventory was full here. Not the way. Now, where the hell do I go now? I think you do need something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, this is what's going on. Fuck it.
It's all right, sir. Okay. Mr. Zombie, don't do that. We have everything. Muscle memory is carrying me in this game. Really hard. Do it, snake. Oh, yes. Don't worry, what they're what Capcom is really working on for the RE the trilogy remaster is imagine you know, I never even thought about it this way. But imagine if when they do the trilogy remaster, they give RE2 and 3 this treatment. Where they just give it this kind of graphics. And that's the remaster. Honestly, with today's current climate of like... Um, remasters. Not too far-fetched. See you around. Oh shit! Thank you, Jaluva. Thank you so much for the 20 gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. I'll go dive my face into the next enemy. Wait. Now I'm going to go get bit by the next zombie, so it counts as a gifted sub. Thank you, Jaluva. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think next game in RE2, I think I might make it so every single sub is a, uh, I shoot a bullet. <laughs> and praise and say one nice thing about RE3. Every step I gift a sub. <whistles> thank you again, Jaluva. Thank you, thank you. Where's the enemies? There's some zombies down here. We're gonna go take a bite. Not you. Zombie around here somewhere. Right? Zombies! Wait. I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. Oh! We don't need these yet. There. Uh. Not this one. Oh my fucking god. Ooh. Thank you, Stumper Gamer! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Stumper Gamer!
What if I controller DC'd there? He might kill me on my way back. Oh wait, no, there's a heal here. I think. I got poison! Scary. If you remake a game and it's worse than the original, you should be a goddamn shame to yourself. But really though, if you think about the concept, like, let's remake a game because it's age bad. Oops. <laughs> it's worse. Like, it's pretty sad. Twin snakes, I'm looking at you. God, twin steaks makes me so sad. I have no problem with the Matrix fights. I have a problem with the voice actors all returning and hating their life while recording their lines. And hating their life while recording the exact same lines that they already recorded in the past. Like, if you're gonna record the exact same fucking dialogue, just reuse the passionate voices from years ago. Oh my god, it's depressing listening to that game. Specifically, Naomi. Also, um, they fucking butchered the soundtrack. That game's music makes you want to vomit. You know, I didn't play it for a long time too, until it was like last year when we played it, I think, or maybe it was this year. Um, I did a Metal Gear Solid marathon and we played Twin Snakes and I was the one that was like, no, you guys are wrong. It's going to be fine. And I fucking hated it. I thought it was horrible. It's like, it's like this game. It's like Resident Evil 1 Remake. If Remake was like, just piss, they did a piss poor job. It's just my own opinion. If you guys like Twin Snakes, that's fine. But also, if you if you say you like Twin Snakes but haven't played, I'm so used to randos. If you say you like Twin Snakes but you haven't played it in like 20 years or 10 years, whatever, then you you might be in my boat too, where it's his best. I should have left it as a memory, because in my memory, I'm like Twin Snakes is awesome. You guys are crazy. And then I replayed it and realized, nope, I was crazy.
And it wasn't even one of those things where like I replayed it and chat like brainwashed because chat like Last of Us 2 syndrome where everyone is shitting on the game. So you're like you're gaslit into thinking like wait, can is this can this game even be good? It wasn't like that at all. It was more so me and chat just laughing. Thank you, 8-Bit. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Fair. But yeah, imagine though, back to the, the point at hand. Imagine if when Capcom does re-release RE1, 2, and 3 together as like a trilogy. God, imagine if they do 2 and 3 like they did this game. That'd be so good. Oh, I don't. I think it's like a 0.1% chance as well. Don't worry. I'm not crazy. The odds are, if it gets a re, if 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 we get a trilogy remaster, it's gonna be the worst thing ever. Everyone is looking forward to it, but it's only gonna be good if they actually work hard on it. And it's gonna be. Super 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 underwhelming because we already have an RE1, 2, and 3 remaster done by modders, which looks amazing. And like the odds of a official Capcom re-release of RE1, 2, and 3 being better than the rebirth versions of RE1, 2, and 3 that we already have access to is like zero percent. The only way it could be is if they add new stuff. That's it. Oof! Same with Tomb Raider Collection? Really? But, uh, wait. Am I missing something? Did modders remaster that game, including the model for Lara? Oh, they did. Cool. I didn't know that, actually. Exactly. I don't even know why I'm grabbing this. If if they don't What what Matt said, if they don't do stuff like you go into the options menu and there is just a yes or no option for door skip and and a language selection and a yes or no option for cutscene tip, the language selection is not a big deal. Like that's like very minuscule. But if there is not a yes or no for door skip and a yes or no for cutscene skip, then or just simply skipping cutscenes. Uh, then that's like they didn't even do bare minimum. Door skip is like an absolute must though. And why it's a must is the PC versions already have door skip. So if they re-release it and it doesn't have an improved version of the already door skip, then that's just fucking terrible. The door skip stuff isn't modded in, it's just part of the game. But they didn't add door skip for this, so... I am a little worried. But that that is one thing, like speaking of like Laura actually looks updated in the new versions. That's something the rebirth versions of RE1, 2, and 3 don't do. Like there isn't a good looking model for Leon or Jill or Chris. So if they did that, that'd be nice. Just hypothetical. Favorite zombie noise? Oh, I'm not sure. I can't act it out either. Oops. Mm -hmm. uh, 
Yo, from RE2 Remake, yeah. No! Uh... Yeah, that's my favorite zombie cry when Brad goes, SORRY! Alright, let's- I will do berry ending. But... I'm a little spooked. Unless he gets killed here, which he might. Oh, he knocked her off. Go, Barry. Go, Barry. Yeah, I think Tomb Raider looks like they're doing the right thing as well. I'll need to look into the remasters. I was sort of a... I was sort of a naysayer. I did see a couple people online complain about the remasters saying that modders have already finished that, but as a speedrunner of Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3, those poor... Uh, is there a rebirth version of Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3? As if, as in like, you literally double click and it works better than any PC game ever. Like, the rebirth versions of Resident Evil do that. It's a, It t turns every RE game into a double click. Change the resolution, no lag. You can change everything about the game and it just works immediately. No, like, no chance of crashing, no chance of a problem. And yeah, I didn't know Tomb Raider had that, if it does. If it is simply like a download, an EXE and double click, then sick. I'll have to look into it. But I was sort of in disbelief that no one's ever told me about it because I've, I've played hundreds of hours of Tomb Raider and you'd think at least one person would come into town and be like, Hey, you know this game has good versions too? But no one's ever said it, so I'm sort of in disbelief. Open Lara? I'll look into that. Oh yeah, there's a ton of modded levels for Tomb Raider. There's, there's, there's a recreation of RE2. Uh... Mod for Tomb Raider 4. And it's actually great. We played it. It's really funny. It is on my YouTube. But it's, it's awesome. Yeah, yeah, it's not fully done yet. Ooh, thank you, Shadow Master. But yeah, when it when it comes to the modding scene, like no no re-releases are going to beat what's already done because you can't transfer over mods that easy. But when it comes to first playthroughs, I hope that the Resident Evil and inevitable Resident Evil re-release and Tomb Raider re-release are the best way to play for first playthroughs. Thank you, Edward. Or like just just a revisit. But for those who don't know, um RE 1, 2, and 3 on, on PC. Unmodded. Like, just their base form are horrible, horrible ports. Yeah, there's a Dino Crisis Rebirth, and he's currently working on Dino Crisis 2 Rebirth. Alright, who's ready for me to explode? Explode. 
There's something wrong with every Resident Evil port. It's sad. Like, the GameCube versions didn't even, like, improve the graphics. I remember reading, like, all the GameCube ports of... Uh... Yo! Oh shit, I, I owe a, I owe an extra fucking bite. Ah! Ah! For the 20 gifted subs. The thank you, Dragon, for the 40 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. I'm glad you're here now. Um what were we just saying? Yeah, the, the GameCube versions have really low reviews, like horrible reviews, because people were expecting them to be like, uh, people were expecting them to be like this game. And when they came out, they were like, the only thing that was added was cutscene skip. And on top of that, the only thing that was added was cutscene skip, okay. But they didn't add the door skip from the PC version. It's just like, okay, nice. We got cutscene skip. But in terms of an old Resident Evil game, yeah, it's slightly higher resolution. In terms of a Resident Evil game, door skip is far more important than cutscene skip. Far more important. Because Cutscenes don't turn anyone off a video game. This game has cutscenes. Oh, I'm not buying that shit. But seven second loads on every single time you go into a new room turns people off completely off like a franchise. This is Exhibit A. All of my friends growing up didn't play these games because of doors. Like they thought like a lot of people look at it as something that's ridiculous. Like, how is it a thing? Outbreak is horrible, horrible, horrible for that. I hate the hope I have enough. I like I do have enough ammo. I'm just gonna grab some extra for, for a final breaking. Yeah, like the Starfield load times, dude. That that's they're awful. People are gonna play Starfield regardless, but people will legit like when they re-release them. They have to make it a selling point. Like when they do the advertising, like. You can also skip doors. Thank you, Calamity. Thank you, Tim. Or instant load times, they should say. Uh, sure. It's it's ma magnificent. <laughs> Ugh. Man, the acid rounds just drop. So does he, though. It's magnificent. Wait, I need to go up here and I need to ditch this. I need my pistol too. Yeah, I have the October schedule started on my, uh, on my schedule, x schedule at the very bottom. It's not complete. I was going to do it all today. Like I have all the notes down and everything, but, um, I forgot September ends today. <laughs> so I, I did the marathon instead. Yeah, the whole... I should have just deleted the entire Google Doc and just put No RE3R makes Bach very angry. Copy-paste. For like a 99 pages. Ah, yeah, this should be enough. Hurry! Barry! Releasing all locks. Resident Tizzle Two.
This might not be enough. See, so remember when I was like, I think it's enough. Kill, use it. Kill it, whatever it is. I know. That was calculated. Uh, Barry? <laughs> Alright. I have played some yeah. I'll be right back really quick. One a moment to everybody. I'll be right to back. Okay, uh, let's go. Jill, you did a fine job. Custom painted! GG. <clears throat> All right. I'm just eating my lunch, but I got a good idea. Um. Hey, Leon, are you okay? Leon? Thank you, Killer Rooster, for the five gifted subs. Thank you. All right. Mm. Mm. Let's do Yeah. Okay. Bio hazard. 
No, wait. But I'm gonna let this run. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb called Raccoon City. It was okay? later revealed that the terrible disaster had been caused by the TB virus, a mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated for use in bioweapon experiments. The Raccoon City Police Department Special Stars Unit immediately began investigation. The case was apparently closed, thanks to the efforts of STARS members Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine. But the Umbrella Corporation's experiments were far We got here. Guy's a maniac. Why'd he bite me? Can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah. First day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. Maniac's gonna ram us. Run. Hello, Rooster, with the 10 gifted subs. Thank you. For every single gifted sub Claire. during this playthrough, I will shoot a bullet. Okay. Head to the station. I'll meet you there. Okay. <sighs>
Head to the station. I'll meet you there. Ten gifted so far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thank you, son, brother. Hold your fire! I'm a human! Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. I might need these. <laughs> and these. What the fuck am I doing? He's still alive back there! Thank you for the 10 gifted subs, Sand and Eyes. Thank you, thank you. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Every gifted sub is a bullet shot. <laughs> you guys are about to figure out how much ammo is in this game. get the shotgun I was going to I should have I was like I went over to the kendo body and I'm like I'm grabbing the shotgun and then I thought to myself what the fuck am I doing <clears throat> Yahoo! thank you magic core for the tear tizzle and the 31 yeah by the way we are doing this marathon because it's the last day of September so if you guys didn't know for the past like five days gifted subs have been 25% off um, and this is the last day for it, so. I'm um, gifted subs, chat's gifted subs, Marva's gifted subs, Kendo's gifted subs. Ah! Oh, man. Who, who are you? Oh, you must be the new guy. You bastard! Leon. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been canceled. <gasps> what happened? About two months ago. There was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered, discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to, to reveal, reveal the, the truth, truth, but no one believed them. Not, Not long, long after, after that. that. All, All this, this started to happen. Oh! Uh, oh! Hang in there. Don't, Don't worry, worry about me. me. Just rescue the survivors in the other room. The hell are you doing? Get out of there. Here. Take this key card. No. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But just go. Fine. But I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. I didn't know. I don't know why he was so big. Uh, uh, five. One, two, three, four, five. Thank you, Panda Leah. Thank you for the five gifted subs. Now you have a stain on the YouTube VOD forever.
What am I doing? Down, down. What am I doing? What am I doing? Do 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 do. Hey, what am I doing? Do 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 do. What? I burped. I I'm gonna. Hey, fucking loot the body, you toad meister. Oh boy, listen, listen. Best game of all time, they say. Listen to his reaction. <laughs> it's your fault. I'm dead. I'm dead. It's 25 gifted subs. Um, thank you, Sloth. I did say I'd move on to the next game, but... That was all your guys' fault. Okay. No, if that happens again, listen, I will just, we'll do Claire. Okay, I'll switch. But if I die again, see, I have to shoot the shots when you guys gift the subs. That's the kicker. That's the kicker. That's a fair exchange. I'm doing this for you guys. Hey, if, if, I, if I had my way, if I had no remorse, I would have fucking chopped this shit off doing? and turned on RE2 Remake. Don't shoot! I'm a human! Ooh. Ooh. Sorry about that, babe. I thought you were one of them. Ah! What's going on in this town? Hold on. I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Ah! No! Thank you, Sloth, for the five gifted subs, by the way. Thank you, Generic. Oh! oh! That was close. I need to change the name of the game. Unless someone else did. Can't wait for someone to gift subs when the liquor drops again. Oh boy. Hang in there. Who are you? Only officer left in the building. 
Who are you? See, he has different there. everything for I'm the scenarios. For Chris. We lost contact with him. Oh, who are you? Chris, Jill Barry. He even has a different hurt sound. Every last star's team member has disappeared. And Leanna, I think he goes. We should have listened. To Ooh. Them. And then Claire, what he happened? goes. Uh, <laughs> All right, I forget. Ago, I forget which is which. This incident involving these zombie-like creatures in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other stars members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. At the risk of their own lives. We're about to find out. But no one believed them uh, uh, okay? don't worry about me just rescue the survivors in the other rooms here take, take this, this key card you ah! should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this and now go but just go okay just hang in there i'll be back soon just go. I have a feeling one of two things. A ton of people in chat are sitting there at the pending screen, trying to line up with the game's delay, or nothing's gonna happen. One of the two. I'm grabbing this. Let's watch the cutscene, why not? <clears throat> Make it easier. Yeah, no one. That's good. Now we're gonna live. Holy f Sorry, Buster, but I'm fucking out of here. Chat is nice. I love this music. This one right here. Sing along, chat. Thank you, where we are. Thank you. Thank you, Pipper Chew. Thank you, everyone. Oh, shit!
What is the actual record of RE2 speedrun? There's like a million categories, but... It's like a 47 or something? 48 maybe? For the most competitive category. I think Claire is faster though, so uh, I don't I don't remember. It's a 40 something. 40 something for every category, I think. Maybe 50 for the B scenarios. Thank you, Ada Hart, for the gifted sub. It's actually a terrible place to shoot <laughs> because the liquor is now aggro. Or was it the best place? New strats. Ada Hoyt! New strat just dropped fresh off the press. Just beat separate ways, nice. What'd you think? By the way guys, I'm shooting a bullet for every single gifted sub this run. And as soon as the gifted sub appears, as soon as the alert starts playing, I start shooting. But I may switch weapons though. What the fuck am I doing? I'm on Leon mode right now. Thank you, Bubble Beast. Oh, this first aid spray. Yikes. I gotta get rid of that. Ah! I got poison! Uh... Leon! Leon! Happy times! Claire. You made it. Yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? Yeah, you just missed Thank it. you, Burial Dancer. I don't know. It's too dangerous for me to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course. But before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. Yes, sir. You know what, Rando, I gotta do one day? M enemies to max. Each room can spawn maximum enemies. Each room can spawn enemies, so like save rooms and everything else. But it's all zombies. <laughs> Whoa, and then do this exact same kind of marathon. Thank you, Tom Alama. I need to ditch. <clears throat> what Resident Evil has the best save theme, guys? Yo, bud. Yo, bud. Is that? CVX, CVX, CVX4. CVX, CVX, CVX4. CVX, CVX, CVX4. CVX, CVX, CVX4. Two, two, two. CVX, remake. Three. Remake, CVX4. CVX, CVX, remake. Four, four. CVX, remake. Separate ways. Oh, Giga Chad. Tier list of Ari zombie sounds. 
If someone gets me, if someone gets me every single zombie sound, I'll do it. Send it over Discord. It's gotta be, it's gotta be. Where are we going? I haven't ran Claire in so long. I mean every zombie sound in the franchise. If there's a who, uh, I want to hear it. Oh shit, with Claire, you actually ditched your pistol and your knife. I'm just now realizing. But I can't because of this challenge. I'm gonna have to go ditch some other shit. That so, sounds like a cat purring. T F tier. I don't care about your hungry cat. Here, I'm gonna let you guys know my favorite RE RE2 zombie sound when it happens. Open up. Hmm. I know where I went wrong. God damn, dude. Time to watch a long play. You guys, I was running Leon, and they had to kill me. What are you doing so close to the wall? That's a good one. <sighs> Thank you, Raven. October hype. That's a classic right there. Listen, this is a cla this is a classic. Oh. I'm biased towards RE2 zombies. I think we all are. Is this the key? Yeah, baby! We won't have to come here later. Guys, I'm gonna give you a lesson about RE2. Alright, do you wanna go down, down? Don't go down, down. You wanna go down, down, right? Sorry. Then you just press down, right. You want to go down, 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 then press right, down, left. 
You want to go down, down, right, then press opposite. Isn't that weird? So if you see people doing insane RE2 menuing, like you're watching someone run RE2 and they're just like, and you're like, how the fuck did they do that inhuman menu? It's because menuing in RE2 is bugged. And, um, it works both ways too. If you're not a speedrunner, you're like, oh, I want to go down, down. And you're just down here. It's like, wait, what happened? It's because if you if you press a certain inputs, it'll take you complete other direction. It's really it's it's bugged. <laughs> My keyboard is missing one key. Back we go. No, it's only on the PC version. What if there was a bathroom in RE2 original? And you could hear a zombie in there. What kind of noises do you think he'd make? I forgot. I couldn't remember if there were zombies in here or not for Claire, but it's the B scenario where they're missing. Marvin! My name is Marvin, Marvin, Marvin. That might be my favorite one. Uh, I think that's the most classic. Oh, RE4 original has the best. If we're talking enemy sound effects, it's RE4 original. No doubt. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I thought you were another one of those zombies. Yeah, I gotta see it, Raven. Chief Irons? Yeah. Yes, that's me. And just who are you? No, don't bother to. <laughs> I was trying it to think of what that was. Just look you at her. Up just like all the others. Listen, just look at her. That's the mayor's daughter. I was told to look after her, but I failed miserably. Just look at her. <laughs> she was a true beauty. The... Her skin, nothing short of perfection. In the last rando I did, but a couple times, putrefy and she will turn into just a said, within the hour just like look at her and nothing there else. Must be some way to stop it. <laughs> In a manner of speaking, uh... that is. Either by putting a bullet through her brain, brain, or by decapitating her completely. Brain. And to think that taxidermy used to be my hobby, but no longer. Please, I'd really like to be alone now. Used to be his hobby? How long have these fucking animals been here? Oops. What was that? What was that? Who's there? Wait. Let me go. 
Easy, easy there. I'm not a zombie. You're safe now. Oh. <laughs> Don't cry, chat. Leon, come in. I found the girl, and I've cleared the wreckage that was blocking the corridor. Got it. Got it. I need a new Bach blub that's horror My themed. Name's Claire. What's yours? Sherry. Do you know where your parents are? They both work at the Umbrella Chemical Plant, near the city limits. The chemical plant? Then what are you doing here? My mom called and told me to go to the police station because it was too dangerous to stay at home. From the look of things, I'd say she was probably right. But it's dangerous here as well. You'd better come with me. But there's something out there. I don't know what it is, but I saw it. Much larger than any of those zombies. And it's coming after me. Shh. What was that? Shit. But that's what I was telling you about. It's here. Sherry, wait. Sherry. You know what's sad about playing this and like actually thinking to yourself that you're playing Resident Evil 2? Going into October. I'm already playing like the best game we're gonna play this month. By a probably by a large margin. So it's only downhill from here. Although at the same time it doesn't really count for me in particular, because I've already played this a million times, so it's not like this is like oh man, this is so fun. But <laughs> you know what I mean. Si going from RE2 to like Siren or like Countdown Vampires. Woo. Yeah, Alan Wake 2, I hope. Signalis sucks. At end stream right now. I've never played Signalis. I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm playing Signalis next stream. First time ever. Overblood replay? That can be arranged. I'm going the wrong way. Oof. I'm still going the wrong way, actually. No, wait, no, I'm not, no, I'm not, no, I'm not, no, I'm not. Overblood? That could be arranged. Sherry, I've been looking everywhere for you. I was so worried. Oh, well, I gotta gift these subs before four o'clock. We've got to go now. So Sherry. that's in. If we stay here, that monster will find us. Let's go. No, I won't. What's the matter? <laughs> Don't you trust me? It's not that, Claire. It's because of my daddy. He's over there. I heard him call my name. Daddy must have been attacked by the monster. Now there should be a lot, Mr. Bolt, yeah. I have to help him. When it comes to new games I haven't played... Wait, Sherry, don't go alone! <clears throat> Sherry! It's usually, Sherry. like, actual new games. As, unfortunately, I've been doing Boktober for eight years now. Um, and I already play a ton of horror games on top of that, so you can only imagine... You know, if it's a good game... 99 times out of 100, I've already played it. So if it's an unplayed game, it's typically pretty bad. But yeah, for those who don't know, uh, just a few things. Uh, tomorrow is October. That's a big month here. I do something called Boktober, change the emotes, change some of the animations, release some exclusive merch for just this month, uh, and we play horror games every single day, or almost every single day. Like, I don't know if I'll be able to pass up on Mario Wonder, and but that's about it. That, the only new game coming out in October that I don't know if I could pass up is Mario Wonder. Everything else, though.
I do have a schedule of a lot of games I will potentially play if you type in Xbox Rex schedule. And why I say potentially play is I always have way too many games on the schedule that there's I even if I wanted to play them all we just couldn't. Um, cause some games are so long they take multiple streams. The first year I did Boktober though, I, I made sure to beat every game in one s sitting. Uh, even Bloodborne one time. Uh, yeah, but yeah, I'm sure, getting too yeah. old for that shit. Did you find your dad? Yes, I'm okay, but I couldn't find him. But I did find something else for you. Here. Here. No, I'm down for beating every game in one sitting. It's just thanks. That was back when I lived with my mom. Why didn't you come over here? And I if I had you. any trouble, it's like, hey, mom, where's supper? Claire. It's not like anymore. that anymore. But don't worry, I'll find another way. I can take care of myself. Thank you, Arakuma. Wait, Sherry, come back. Sherry! 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 Do I even need to go in here? I don't think so. But I'm in here now. We avoided the liquor. It's funny how most of the downstairs area you don't have to do. Alright. Fuck, do I even have the inventory for this shit? One second. No, I gotta re-add that. I didn't finish the list. Uh, it's a Twitch highlight, I think. I played it twice, though, Capnia. I, I have it also on my VODs channel, or my main channel. I think it's my main channel. All right, the hardest, one of the hardest dodges in RE2. Right here, we probably won't get it. Oh! Wait. I almost forgot there's a liquor in here. That was the perfect time to gift to the sub. From the moment I enter the blue corridor until I leave, <laughs> if you guys gifted subs, I would just die. Probably. But you're fresh out of luck now. general I don't think this is the right way I'm genuinely curious about uh, do we ever need to use the lighter again I'm genuinely curious about the future dead by daylight at this point I feel like it's we're finally at a point where 
they need to add something new. I only say that because, like, the Alien DLC just didn't give it a big bump. And Alien's, like, one of the biggest franchises in the world. Yeah, well, Jason, I also think Fred or uh, Five Nights at Freddy's, but yeah, Jason, too. Oh my god, I just hope that they finally do something. Like, change the game. That's it. Fortnite style, where you flip the game on its head completely. I think that's the only thing that would get me to really enjoy it again in a uh, long term. Yellow sword. Um, I might play it. If they give Texas Chainsaw an update, I'll play. Yeah, the price of the DLC is uh, quite something. But honestly, I'm pretty sure big skins like that in Dead by Daylight cost the same amount. I'm not sure though. It does look pricey. But when it comes to prices about stuff, I don't fucking care. I'm so hyper fixated on people being upset about separate ways. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep kicking that dead horse. No, it wasn't bad. It's amazing. But people are angry it's $10. Because it should have been free. Or that's, that's the mindset. Which, with that logic, RE4 should have been free. If you bought RE4 original. Sherry, you're okay. I'm glad to see you're safe, Claire. Like, what, what is the difference between saying those two things? Like, oh, RE4 Remake should be free. I own the OG. How is it any different than Separate Ways is free with the OG, so it should be free with the remake? Claire! I'm going down there. Stay here and wait for me, okay? That's what I don't understand. I know. I'm also shocked they charged... I, th I feel like ten dollars is super cheap. I need to add that to my soundboard. Gargle on that dick, irons. Just look at him. Like, uh, bitching about it and saying, like, oh, it should be free, that's one thing, but giving it a bad review, so you've made it this like, and that's Not why bad, is girl. just like, I'm come on, man. Anyone leave my town, everyone's gonna die. Calm down, Chief. What happened? Shut up. You couldn't possibly understand what's happened. Those monsters from Umbrella have destroyed my beautiful you. town. How could they do that to me after everything I've done for them? So it's true. You have been working with Umbrella. How could they do but that you to must him? Know about the G virus. What is it? Tell me. If you must know, it's 
the agent that can turn humans into the ultimate bio weapons. Superior to the T virus in, in every, every way. way. Dr. William Birkin is the genius behind the project. Gene William Birkin. I'm sure you've already seen his What if his name was Billiam Jerkin? Somewhere. And he was a coomer, but he was also like the smartest scientist in the world. Already figured it out. The monster that's been tearing my prison apart is yet another product of the G virus. An ultimate bio weapon. Umbrella must be trying to cover its tracks. But if I have to go, I'm going to take you with me. Me? Uh, my chest! I just can't take the pain! <laughs> um, I forgot to grab the grenade launcher. No, we might be able to kill him still. How much bullets? How many bullets do I have? We got this. <laughs> Get off you fuck boys. God, these little fucks are so annoying. Yeah, get fucked. By the way, the same sub gift incentive is not going to work for our to remake because that's just rip. What the fuck is this? Oh yeah, I got to go back and get Sherry. I haven't ran this in so long. Thank you so much. Oh, we are. Claire, you came back. I can't believe the man who developed the G virus is actually her father. What's wrong, Claire? What's wrong? It's nothing. But I think I found a way out of here. We should be able to find some place safe if we can just make it out of town. But... Don't worry, I'll protect you. Ouch! I promise. But you have to make sure you don't leave my side. Resident Evil Outbreak as well. File 1 or 2. You bless us. Leon, are File you still One. There? And if you guys want to join, leaving. boot up the game. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be alright, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Claire. Claire. Wait, thank you, Reaper. Thank you, Black the Reaper. Only file one. File one potentially takes like two hours. Yeah, that's one thing I like more about the original. Claire and Leon actually talk to each other a lot, and in the remake they have like one interaction, and then one over the radio at the end. Come on, let's get out of here. 
out of here. Am I only playing the originals this stream? Um. Uh, I, I don't know. Exclamation Rock Marathon, everybody. I did change the gifted sub thing for this game. Every gifted sub is a bullet I shoot. On the spot, too. On the spot. Chad already killed me once. Oh! No, I don't read comics. But my brother writes comics. I read his sometimes. No, my brother lives in PEI. Alright, I'm gonna use the bathroom really quick. Who are you? Hold your horses, everybody. I'll be right back. Another spy sent by Umbrella, right? Let me guess. You're here to steal my husband's key virus, aren't you? Husband? Then you must be Annette. Sherry's wandering. What? Sherry's wandering around alone in the sewers. You have to help me find her. That's impossible. I told her to go to the police station. What's she doing here? William will be after her. William? That's right. The creature that's been causing all this destruction is none other than my own husband. This way. No one will ever take you away from me. There he is. So you finally come. Doctor, we're here to collect the G-Virus sample. Sorry, but I won't just hand over my life's work. Stop it. You might hit the sample. That's it, all right. Okay, let's move out. William. Oh, my. Hold on, darling. I'm taking care of that bullet wound first. Stay here. Alpha team, have you retrieved the sample yet? Affirmative. We'll be at the rendezvous point in one minute. Roger. <gasps> Are you telling me that he 
injected the G-Virus into his own body? The G-Virus has the ability to revitalize cellular functions. What, what, what was that? Something's wrong. Let's check it out. Over there! Shoot! Eat this, you freak! The guns aren't stopping it! What is this thing? Hurry! Reckon? What's he doing? What, what is this thing? Shoot him! Fire! 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 Beep boop boop beep boop beep boop beep boop beep. It's already too yeah. late, everybody. And that's not even the entire story. What's Every G virus bioweapon, including William, has the ability to implant embryos into other life forms. Forms? That's why he's left to share. What are you trying to say? The bodies of individuals with non related genetic coding are likely to reject the embryo. But since Sherry is his is non-existent. No more games with unskippable cutscenes after this. Survival instinct. Ah! It's Sherry. You go Bach that way. equals cock. That's correct. <laughs> do do do. Thank you, Comfort and Iverdog. You know, I'm gonna play Harvester all bucked over. I was thinking about adding Harvester to the list because I haven't played it in forever. But I fucking hate that game. Thank you, Nubasaurus. Sherry! Ah! Thank you, Untouchable Gamer. You tried. You tried. You sly devil. Sly devil. Come on. Wake up, Sherry. Who's that little guy? Stay there, Sherry. How old is Sherry? I think like 52. Incredible AI. Incredible. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> All right, get out of here. Get the hell out of here, 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 here. Come on, Shirley. Oh, shit. No one in chat better be drinking. That's bad for you. Bad for you. As I assume half the chat is slamming back. Be goddamn shamed. What am I doing? I used to drink all the time. Now I drink like ugh, maybe like once a year. Come on, Shirley. The last drinking stream? That was... I don't even know. Maybe... New Year's? I'm not sure. No reason in particular for remix. On my birthday, maybe. Claire, my stomach. I can't remember. My stomach hurts. Thank you, retro nerd gamer. Hang in there, Sherry. Dude. It's burning up. I've got to hurry before the embryos pupate. I've already drank enough for a full lifetime. Super sleepy tea. Let's -a go. With the 90 months. Let's -a go. Thank you, sir. The 90. 100 around the corner. You know what I have to say about that? Let's -a go. That was a big mistake. That was also a big mistake. Bow now now. Thank you, Corky. Kaki. <laughs> Sherry. Oh. oh. <laughs> Sherry. <sighs> that 
was hype train. Claire? Oh, you're finally awake. Alcohol's always made my stomach Isn't hurt. Like my friends used to make fun Thank of me because if they ever had like pre drinks sure at their house or anything, or one friend in particular, Thank you, Claire. um, I'd always eat their Even bread because like I need I'm to eat child. some bread before I drank. Or I didn't need to, but it definitely made my stomach work. hurt way less. But I sometimes, like if I was out drinking, oh, but I could dummy a freaking half a loaf. I finally have someone to rely upon. But usually if, if I just get like one I'll slice be right of bread. Back as soon as I found the antidote for you. Mm. Wait, it's this way. I don't know where I'm going. I would like that. I don't even eat bread much anymore. I can't remember the last time I bought bread at the grocery store. A long time ago. At least like four or five months ago. Substitute? Uh, nothing really. Oh, I love carbs. But. I know, I love... One thing I have trouble with being a chef... Like, I, if there's unhealthy ingredients involved, I can make anything easily. And by unhealthy ingredients, I mean from anything to like bacon fat all the way to just like... Soy sauce or ponzu or like hoisin sauce or... I'm talking anything like even slightly unhealthy. When you cut out everything unhealthy, it's so hard to cook. Good meals. Mm. Well, there's no key to cooking really, it just depends on what you're making. Just depends. But fat it does equal flavor. That's good for you. So our burgers. William, I'll never forgive you. Let's not get into how much. <laughs> I've just prepared a sample of the G virus, and this time, no one will take it from Salt's me. Salt's healthy for you. This is the most significant piece of research my husband has ever left in my hands. Sugar's good for you. Stop it! Sherry's in serious trouble. William implanted her with his embryos. There's no telling when they'll pupate, and if that happens, then Sherry won't. Do. What? William. No, I would say that. I mean, I'm just, I'm just memeing. You can say anything's good for you as long as I don't specify the amount. Uh, w William is still alive. He's getting stronger with each skin he casts Cheese is off. good for you. Sh Sherry! Parmesan cheese is good for Tell you. Tell me what I need to know. How can I save Sherry? 
I have detailed information. See, it, it's like everything you need. Dark to learn chocolate's to very good for you. It's right here. If you have like two squares, but and who's gonna have two squares? Save my daughter, and tell her I'm sorry I wasn't a better mother. Tell her I love her. Sure. I actually had uh, my lunch. You guys want to hear a fucked up diet? Every time I share my diet, everyone's like, "Really?" <laughs> or when I'm actually taking it serious. But like for lunch, I had uh, two squares of dark chocolate, um, a handful of pumpkin seeds, a handful of cashews. Uh, this is when I took my break earlier when we were watching the ending to Are You on Remake? Uh. What else do I have? Like three slices of beef. Uh, a teaspoon of. Leon, you made it. What's it called? B. Where are you? I can see you on the monitor. What is? Oh my god, I can't think of it. But never mind that right That's now. it. Leon, you have to go back and get. And then some kefir. Like Please. two, or like a, a cup of kefir. Wait a second. That's it. <clears throat> Where are you going? I still have a few loose ends to take care of. I'm counting on you. Oh, that wasn't snacking. What do you consider a lunch? That is 100% not snacking. People just have it burned into their brain that you need, like, starch, veggies, and meat to make a meal up. But in reality, it's not even healthy. But I don't want to go down the nutrition, uh, I don't want to go down to the nutrition hole for a Twitch conversation because <laughs> nutrition is like the actual nutrition when you really get, like, let's say there's like 20 nutritionists in the chat. It's worse than politics. It really, truly is. Gym routines are worse? Well, gym routine means nothing without talking about nutrition first, so... Dude, where's the fucking mo disc? No, it doesn't matter. Ah! 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 Oh, for fuck's sakes, I should have got a heal instead. Yeah, Snickies, basically. Like, we live in an age where some people are insanely healthy, eating nothing but meat. Like, nothing but a steak every day for every meal and literally nothing else. And we, in, this, in the same breath, there are people that will eat nothing, nothing but vegetables. There are people that will eat nothing but fruit and raw milk and raw honey. Like, you know, it, when, at the end of the day, when it comes to nutrition and, and, and why I bring up my diet and like people always make fun of me every time I say what I have for lunch and whatnot, um, is the true diet that you should be on is what makes you feel good. One person's diet could be the healthiest thing in the entire world, like scientifically. But you know, if you have an irritation like to legumes and that's half that person's diet, well, like, like for example, I'm lactose intolerant. Nice, dude. I forgot to do the main fucking thing upstairs. Woo, Lily! Ah! You know what? That's the last time I talked to you guys in chat. Anyway, after I say this, you guys aren't allowed to talk anymore. 
I'm lactose intolerant. So raw milk may be super healthy and Parmesan cheese may be super healthy, but you know, I would have to take a lactose pill every single time. So is the trade-off worth it or should I just substitute it for something else? You know what I mean? And even with that lactose pill, it still probably takes away a lot of the benefits because it's still upsetting my stomach. I was just, it was a hypothetical. I'm aware there's lactose free milk. I mean, I'm lactose intolerant. So, like, you know, <laughs> all I have is lactose free milk. Thank you, Quentin. Lactose free milk still upsets my stomach. You fuck, boys. Oh wait, I know what you're supposed to do with Claire now. It's all coming back. Come here, asshole. Why are you aiming at nothing? Nice, I wasn't paying any attention. Ah, fuck! Uh, oh, the, if you're lactose intolerant, um, there's pills out there that you could take before you um, eat lactose and it makes it so it just gives you an enzyme that helps break down the lactose and helps you digest it I I get like I have spent that actually at this point like tens of thousands of dollars on lactose pills or not tens of thousands but like ten thousand like lactose pills are like thirty dollars a box and I've I must have bought at least I don't know I mean, look at this. It's sitting right in front of me. <laughs> like, I have lactose pills like every room in my house. I just have so many. Uh, oh yeah, I need to get this first. No, you don't need- they're at the gro they're at the- They're at the pharmacy. If you guys are lactose intolerant in chat and don't know about lactose pills, they're a fucking godsend. Like, I, I don't stray away from anything that has lactose anymore. But some things still upset my stomach. Like, for example, feta cheese. It doesn't matter if I take a lactose pill or not. It still upsets my stomach a lot. But lactose pills are very expensive, though. By the way, the reason, if you're new to the channel or whatever, thank you, McLovin. The reason I'm so passionate about this topic, I am a chef, and I have been a chef for a long time. And I also took a, have a small background in nutrition. But with that being said, I don't know shit about nutrition. Like, I, I know a little, but definitely not an expert. But it's real, nutrition's really hard. Like I said, it's like worse than politics because, you know, eggs are a really good example of, if you'd watch the news, like as you grew up, growing up in like the 90s, early 2000s, you turn on the news and every year, eggs would be healthy, then they'd be unhealthy, then it'd be like, oh, well just have the yolk. And they'd be like, no, just have the egg white. Be like, no, no, they're only good if they're boiled. Like, eggs are one of those things that have always been a back and forth. Now, I think eggs have been figured out for the most part at this point. Five minutes until but, detonation. um, you know, just nutrition in general. You'll have two highly trained nutritionists on the internet, both saying polar opposite things with factual contradictions to each other. It's just like, it's a mess. Yeah, Thaddeus, basically. Did 
We actually got the speed strat. Eggs are good. Lately, oh, here's one big one, oatmeal. A lot of people say oatmeal is like one of the healthiest breakfasts you could have, and then there's a lot of people that say oatmeal is one of the worst things you put in your body. But it's because of the, the phallic acid. <sighs> there's phytic acid. I f um, but... Anyway. Oh, thank you, Sir Muzi, for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. But like oatmeal stops the absorption of some minerals like magnesium. What are the other ones? I don't give a fuck what they are because it doesn't affect my diet. But, but the thing is, it only lasts your system for so long. So like if you're pairing like the minerals that make it hard to absorb, if you're pairing that with your oatmeal, then it's sort of pointless, you know what I mean? But if you're having oatmeal with different minerals, you're gonna absorb them fine. The acid doesn't matter. But see, in the in the fucking echo chamber of the internet, people will just be like, oatmeal's terrible for you, it has this that eats your minerals. It's like, well, that doesn't matter if you don't include those minerals with that, di with that meal. Just like, that's nutrition for you, basically. So like you'll have people that want to trend just saying something's really bad for you because negative stuff trends. But I have to find my brother. Yeah. Right. This is just the beginning. Yeah, exactly. You have it later in the like I had oatmeal when I woke up, and oatmeal makes it hard to absorb magnesium. God has protected you. It will always be with you. Claire, a sherry. I have pumpkin seeds for magnesium, okay? And a couple other things. So, I'll have my oatmeal, and then like four hours later, five, six, seven hours later, I'll have my pumpkin seeds for the magnesium and the other vitamins and minerals. I'm sorry for the boring topic. Oh, please don't cry, guys. Oops, I meant to pause the timer. I skipped it. So, look at fucking Sherry back there. Oh my god. I don't know what to do for gifted subs for RE3 remake. I might go back to just getting bit. The original plan. Oh shit, do I s I might still have the stupid mod on. Oh wait, no, I played that. Let me check if I have the mod on. Two sized every story. Two sized every story. Yeah, love that story. Uh, this isn't looking good. <laughs> I think I need to restart the game. No, not because of the skin. I think the nightmare mod's on. Freeze! It is. God damn it, dude. Resident Evil 2. One sec. Well, yeah. Resident Evil. Chew. Maybe I'll turn on my schoolgirl Leon outfit. Oh my god, I'm on page four of RE2 Remake mods and it's still just Claire. Whatever, fuck this. I'm just turning the mod off.
All right. Mods, mod manager, all mods, back to category list. Resident Evil 2 remake. Enemies, nightmare off. There. There we go. Okay. Resident Tizzle 2. I don't take vitamins really much anymore either. I take vitamin D and probiotic. Resident Evil 2. But one common misconception about taking vitamins and minerals is you got to know what you need. And to do that, you need a blood test and the doctor needs to be like, eh, hey, you're low in, you know, iron, but, and you have a really high magnesium level and you could be taking magnesium supplements. Just thinking like, this is healthy. Everyone takes it on the internet. And in reality, your diet was super heavy in magnesium. You didn't need the supplement. Nutrition suck. Don't look into it. You'll hate your life. Just just eat whatever the hell you want. <laughs> I hate that I actually pay attention to nutrition. It it honestly is depressing. You'll think you'll just don't even fucking bother. You all right? Water is bad for you. Uh, I'll be back for you. Let's go, people. I'll shoot. I will shoot you asshole. Yeah. Got him, skater. Go, go, go. What the? Uh. Oh, you uh. see those quick turns? Gotta unplug my controller. Thank you, Mango Madness. This is out of control. This is out of control. Guys, this is out of control. This is out of control. Shit. Oh, I didn't notice I had the original RE2 soundtrack on. One sec. There it is. The station. I love RE2 make zombie sounds. I love this game so much. Definitely could have been. It definitely could have been better with the B scenarios, but. Cause we just played with. We just played RE2 OG with the OG soundtrack on. Fuck. Oh my god, it is Leon, guys. Here. Maybe this will bring him back. One sec. There. It's Leon now. Just don't look at his... Jesus. Open up! Hurry! Open up! Open this goddamn door! door! No! Jesus! They're everywhere! It's great squeak. It's great squeak. Does anyone know what started this? Marvin started this. Oh shit. Does anyone in chat know what started this?
This is not how I imagined my first day. About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombie-like creatures in a mansion located on the outskirts of the city. Chris, Jill, Barry. Just look at her. Uh. It's probably pretty hard to tell I like Resident Evil. Nice wainer, bro. Got him. The zombie sounds are so good in this game, honestly. Like, just hearing them in the background, like... How much money do I make a month for Twitch? Billions. That's an easy question to answer. How much money do I make on Twitch? However much you guys want to give me. <laughs> That's the Twitch. That's Twitch. Uh, Marvin, I've got a situation here. here. I'm surrounded by zombies. That's Marvin, Twitch. One month, two dollars. The next month, two million dollars. When I first, when I got a mortgage on my house, like in 2019, um, like the talking to the bankers about it, like, what's your income? Just like, uh, well, you see, you know, this month I'm like a wealthy businessman, and last month, well, I was riding the poverty line, so uh. And they're like, sold. It's complicated, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, what am I? Oh, I almost the royally fucked up. Oof. God damn, I'm good. That was such a good shot. I fucking nailed him. I do love running this game, but man, it's a sketchy one, even on standard. Like even after doing the like nightmare mod and stuff, it could definitely be a tough speed run to stay alive in. Stream only for fun? 
Real job? Ninety hour weeks. Yeah. My other job is is fine with that. Real job. I don't think they meant it in the way that Chad is making fun of them for it. Oops. I honestly, like, the evilest part of me wishes. Now, I'm sorry, I'm gonna do a bit of humble bragging. I always wish people would come in here and say that kind of shit to me. But no one ever does. Because I got a great rebuttal of having another career before this. But I can never... I can never have that conversation. Because no one makes fun of me very often. I wish they did. Why is the flashbang in the number one slot? Lion Branch Bird. I think. But back in the day, people used to say that a lot on Twitch. Like, oh, I fucking... Like, get angry at the streamer for streaming. But I never really got that much. Welcome! Ah! Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Hello, chicken man. Hi. Have you ever played Fable or have you ever go about playing it on stream? I've watched people play Fable, but no, I've never played it. Thank you, Keeping Light, for the $4.20. Um, looks fun though. Maybe I'll play the new one when it comes out. Ah! Thank you, PJ. Thank you for the big 2 1. But no, I've been doing this full time for over seven years now. Oh no, I'm gonna have to actually play the game correctly because I have my FPS capped at 144, but that doesn't really boost you up much from the 120 average. Well, the thing about streaming, guys, like, I, if you're jealous of streamers or whatever, here's the beautiful thing about streaming. Everyone can do it. And if you're, if when I said that, the first thing that came to your mind was an excuse, like anything, I started streaming with a full-time job and a girlfriend and pets and I still streamed oops hey I'm not done talking to you uh... and even back then but by the way when I first started I thought it was too saturated when I was first getting in I was like oh man it's already too late but it's never too late But at the same time, to be devil's advocate for those who are actually sad, they want to stream and they just don't have time or whatever you think, you don't have the personality, whatever, the gaming skills, it doesn't matter. Where I love this job, I love streaming, I love my community, I love doing this every day. Um, I also passionately love video games, so it's easy for me. Um, but if you don't 
like your passion for video games if it's not strong enough the downsides to streaming may outweigh your passion for video games thankfully for me it doesn't but it is a reality Wait, no! What is it? This one. What?! See, anyone can stream. Even me. What the fuck is it?! I, I swear it's... It's... Isn't it this? What is it? I know it's three up. One down. Maybe it isn't. Maybe it's two? See you guys. Anyone can stream. Thank you, Kiko. I'd rather just watch you do it and you can take my advice. Thank you. Starting to become a streamer isn't all it's cracked up to be. I basically sold my soul to the devil to do this. And what I mean by that is I... I, uh... I went from being a social butterfly, went to all the parties, all the... all the pre-drinks, had a ton of friend groups. I had like a lot of close friends and I went from all that to <laughs> nothing. All that to never, ever, ever, ever leaving my house. Why aren't they doing anything? You bastard. I'll, I'll count it. Fuck it, dude. I don't know why they didn't react. I tried to take that herb. I already have one. All right. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Yeah, I mean, I, like if you're an introvert, that sounds amazing. I've always been a very big mix of both. I'm an introvert if I'm with a bunch of, like, strangers. But if I'm with my good friends, I am an ex extreme extrovert. Oh wait, I need this. But I'd always rather be alone, for the most part. 99 times out of 100. Thank you, Kuko. Oh, oh for fuck's sake. Tur turn it back, you fucking. I'm so used to f RE4, <laughs> where everything's just spam. <laughs> I don't know.
Oh man, I have whiplash from how how much my life emotional whiplash from how much my life is different from when I was in college. Uh, I don't mean I just mean this just to tell a chapter of my life. I had a lot of friends and went to a lot of different parties and stuff and hung out with a lot of different people like every single solitary day. It's probably the least I played video games in my life. I still played them, but um, there definitely was a couple days where I didn't per week. But regardless, then as soon as I got out of college, it was like the polar opposite. It was like <laughs> zero interaction. Or no, oh no, not when I got out of college, as soon as I started streaming. You bastard! <laughs> Thank you, here comes the fuzz. Thank you, Darius. Yeah. Man, who who's with me here? You know what ruined? My brothers used to get so mad at me for this. When I was growing up, like Super Nintendo, N64, uh, Xbox, Xbox 360, Wii. Like in that era, I played like every... I rented games all the time. Like I spent all my money renting games and buying games and just playing free games on the internet, on PC, and just buying like used games like all the time. And as soon as I started playing MMOs, like Fantasy Star Online is my first one, I went from Fantasy Star Online to City of Heroes to Star Wars Galaxies to World of Warcraft to Age of Conan, Counter-Strike Source, uh, you know, even like Gary's Mod, like everything. If it was online, I played, like, my variety of gaming went down by like 95%. I just was straight addicted to online gaming. So like in that era, like right when the Wii was fresh, like, I, I just stopped playing games. I stopped having a variety. And my oldest brother used to hate me for it. Not hate me, but like, he was like, Man, why do you only play one game all the time? Or like, he, they don't, they didn't get it. Like, people that didn't play online games didn't get it. They were like, you know, in their brains, it's like, you know, this person went from playing 40 different games a month to just one for the whole year. Why do you do this? <laughs> that shot at least distracted the zombie. God damn it, I'm gonna end up using this stupid herb on that zombie. Oh, it got to the point where both of my brothers just like, I've been through many fist fights with them because I'm in the middle of playing like World of Warcraft and they would come in and just pull the ethernet cord out of the router because they were so mad. Uh, that's all I did. And then we just instant fist fight. Instant mom coming down screaming. What am I doing? All right. Now people buy a console for one game, yeah. Where is everyone? Yo! Oh, I can't remember the specifics, but they definitely unplugged it many times. Yeah, I'll count just for you guys. Ah! I'll count a dog bite for once. Just for fun. Oof. They are zombie. Okay. Yeah, I've seen that a lot in chat today. x ray Spark Marathon. Read the fine print. Thank you very much. Thank you, impatient. 
Zombie. Every single zombie bite. Uh, co bracket human bite takes damage. Uh... That was wrong. Ah. Uh... But I don't know. Alright, what am I doing? What am I doing? Uh oh. No! Uh -oh. Oof. I know, the one time you don't want a critical, yeah, the guy falls on you. It's like, ah. Uh. Can I crouch? See, I miss crouching. If this was RE4, it'd be under there by now. You know what they need to add to Dead by Daylight to make the game popping again? RE4 remake Ada costume. Is that the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. End it. Well, what exactly are you looking uh, for? Thank you, Johnny. I appreciate the 18 months. Thank you. Yeah, everything in games looks so easy, and then you try doing it. It's same with me sometimes. When I'm learning a new game, I'm just like, oh, this looks easy. You go try it, it's just like, why is this ungodly hard? Yo, cuz, thank you for the eight months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Heard of the Umbrella Corporation? They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into... Thank you, Cyber. That explains the horrible things I've seen. Wee. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Gee, Gee thanks. thanks. Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. Thank you, Ram Ranch Manager, for the five minutes up. Come okay? on, sewers are run by the city. I'll take a big old zombie bite for you. Without the authorities knowing. I don't know what we're at, but I'm gonna take a big old zombie bite for you. Jesus, that an earthquake. And then we'll reset the counter to zero. What the hell? Oops. Crocodile bite. Again? It's not too late to turn back. No chance. No, 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 no. I know, Separate Ways is so fucking good, I can't get over it. Holy shit! I love it. I think it's amazing. Up here. 
What the hell was? Just get up here. Can't say I didn't warn you. You said the virus turned people into monsters, not reptiles. Fair point. I'm just impressed you made it in one piece. Do 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 do. He is so shiny. So let me get this straight. Umbrella sells monsters like that to who? We should be Our playing as Ada right now. Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the virus. Something about the Writers Guild, Sean. I, or not the Writers Guild. The uh, voice actors. The voice actor anonymous. The voice acting and hiring people to do voice acting jobs is much more complex than you'd think. There's like a lot of rules and regulations being in uh, the Voice Actors Guild or whatever it's called. Um, I don't know the specifics. I don't even know what I'm talking about, which is why I'll end it there. But. That's the general idea. It's secret weapon time. I'm pretty well, okay. I'm pretty sure that like the you have to pay voice actors a specific like minimum if they're in the voice actors guild or whatever it is. Uh the screen actors, I don't know what it's called. And this voice actress for Ada is in that, and the other one isn't. Something along those lines. So Capcom was like, we don't want to pay a few extra dollars. Oh yeah, I gotta get bit by a zombie for... Ram Ranch. Here you go. Tastes good? Ah! Yo, Val. Always been good at running. Persistent bastard, aren't you? Oops. Thank you, Sacred Melon. I don't know. Like, I don't know what happened with the voice actor. It is a shame, though, but it is what it is. Capcom... Resident, e Resident Evil is not overly known for its good voice acting anyway, so... We, we got really lucky when it switched to the RE engine. We were bound to have a tumble sooner or later. Yeah, it's fine. I'm, I'm aware that some people like it, some people dislike it, but overall people fucking hate it and that's just, it just is what it is. If you if your own specific taste, you enjoyed it, sure. Um, but generally speaking, people consider it a travesty, so that's the topic. And the reason is, I can explain why. Most people, especially weebs, base voice acting 100% off the sound of someone's voice. Like, they'll judge it instantly based off the sound. Which, it's nothing to do with acting, it's just about what it sounds like. So with that being said, Ada has always had a particular sound. And the new voice actress, Lily Gao, sounds nothing like that. The mannerisms, nothing. Like, she just went for a completely different approach, and that is why people hate it. That's a pleasant 
else, you know. But at the same time, I still don't think she's a great voice actress, but I don't mind it anymore. But it's a mix of both things. It's a it's a heavier mix of like she's doing her own thing and also, you know, she is a she is a rookie voice actress. So it's both things. I don't mind her anymore though. It's whatever. No one talks about how Asuka sounds different? <laughs> you... Oh, Garza, you... Ah... Uh, you poor innocent soul. People are just much more vocal about Ada, but a lot of people don't like Wesker either. You know what's funny though? Like, so Wesker is a much bigger character than Ada. Like, just on the voice acting topic, what is funny to me is like, Ada's voice actress doesn't overly matter. Like, people won't, uh, like, until now, people won't be overly speculative of it. They don't really care about Ada. What's funny is Wesker's had a few voice actors, but. And they've all done their own thing, but I think like both interpretations of Wesker have been awesome. The over-exaggerated like, like the over-exaggerated Wesker from RE5 and then the other, I don't even know the voice actor for Wesker in Zero and, uh, and, um, four separate ways. It's not DC Douglas and CVX. And but I like both of them. I think both approaches were, were fine. And I, I actually and why I think it's fine and why people don't talk about it more is because his descent into madness sort of fit the evolution of his voice acting. DC Douglas for CVX and Zero. Are you sure about that? Excuse me, asshole. Mm. No, it wasn't DC Douglas. Why do people just say stuff? But with that being said, I mean, that sort of proves the point as well of, you know, they sound vastly different and some people don't even know they're different people. Because it lines up with the character. My inventory is way too packed. Yeah, I, that's exactly it, uh, Mila. It doesn't matter. Like, this this topic can go in circles. Like, it's all preference about voice acting, like what your personal thoughts are. But uh, do we even have the inventory space for all this shit? I I have an extra knife or something. Well, yeah, it's RE voice actor tier list. Resident Evil honestly isn't the best franchise to measure. Well, uh, no, that's not fair. But oh my god, well, it's just a lot of the older voice actors. 
Crap. Oh my God, how did that, how did that connect? Don't you dare. I tried to parry it because I thought this was already for her. Huh? I don't really care either way. Like, you know, well, I don't care anymore about the Ada stuff. It's whatever. I doubt she's going to stay the voice actress anyway, so. And Separate Ways was awesome. Separate Ways is really what mattered, and Separate Ways ended up being really good, so. I don't know what I'm doing, do da do da. I don't know what I'm doing. But the voice acting lately in RE Engine games has been really good. Like, I love, uh, like, Leon and Jill and Claire. Um, Lady Dim, all the sisters, Moreau, like, all the characters have been great. Our village had great voice acting. Even Ethan did a good job. But Ethan's writing was just a little more complex in Village, so. Well, the thing is about Ethan, it's like... Ethan's a tough one to judge voice acting because he is sort of a one-dimensional character. But when he needed to portray emotion in Village as opposed to Seven, I think he did a fine job with it. Damn it, again?! Jack Baker nailed it in, vil in 7. I forget if this is king or queen. I think it's king. I always forget. And again, when it comes to the voice acting front, one thing... Like a very common thing is... Sometimes... Sometimes, depending on the writing... A... No voice actress can escape bad writing, sometimes. Okay. Almost there like, poor, uh... Poor Hayden Christensen with, like, the, oh, I hate sand, it's coarse, it's... Real. Like, no one's talking themselves out of that one. I almost went to voice acting school. It was one of my my paths I was gonna choose. I've always been really interested in voice acting. Thank 
you, Dazzin. Being a voice actor requires a lot of confidence, though. Because, like, not many people... Many people find it not not degrading isn't the right word, but like, Let's hope that's the last um, like, oh my god, like talking like a complete buffoon, like some people just can't do it. It's just like internal cringe so much that you might die on the spot. But it all depends on what you're playing. Like if you're playing like Leon in RE4, you know, you're a badass, you like you just you're a cool guy. Your voice acting sounds really cool. If you're playing like I'm trying to like Chopper, the character in One Piece, the English one, just like eternal cringe, you're gonna you're about to implode. Gollum, yeah, Gollum is another good one. Smeagol, Steve. I think, well, I don't know. Steve, like, everyone hates Steve, but at the same time, I don't know how much acting went into that. That might just be the actor's voice. I'm not sure. I'm not saying that to be, like, insulting or anything. I, I just don't know. I don't know who the voice actor is. and But for all I know, it sounds like... Uh, it just sounds like his normal voice, or could be. For your safety, stand clear until the doors are fully open. You know what, Chris Pratt, dude? I I thought he did great in the Mario movie, and you know what I loved? Like people were complaining that, like, and I was too. But the first trailer came out, it's like oh, he doesn't sound Italian or like Mario at all. And I love how they opened up. No, I didn't say I don't like Chopper. I'm trying to think of a super like internal cringe voice and oh, 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 like screaming like you're like minus age, like you're like you're minus ten years old, like some child with like this insanely high pitched voice. That's Chopper. That's all I meant by that comment. Viruses. But uh, yeah, I love how they opened up the Mario movie with the. Italian voice acting and he play he I think he did a great job with the Italian Mario voice. I thought it was awesome Oh, that's not the way But yeah, Chris Pratt, I think he did fine for Mario in the trailers I was like, oh no, but in the actual movie. I thought it was fine. I Loved the Mario movie. I thought it was so good. I, why do I have so many knives? Yeah, Jack Black fucking nailed it. Jack Black is just such a passionate person. If 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 he's on a project he's passionate about, he's just gonna kill it. Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong. Like, I, I didn't mind him as Donkey Kong, but he was definitely just Seth Rogen <laughs> talking. But some some voice actors, or some people that do voice acting, they, they're, they're almost typecast in a way that they don't change their voice. There, there's like two heavily different kinds of voice acting. One is where you just you just act like you you portray your emotions as you're asked to portray them if you're sad oh, oh you know if you're happy oh yeah but then there's people that completely change their entire voice they don't even sound human anymore they don't then you would never guess it was them like uh the guy who plays mario uh, charles marinette like he plays like 50 different characters and some of them, yeah, they sound similar. Like Wario sounds like Waluigi and, and Mario and Luigi. But then there's other ones he plays that sound nothing like the previous characters. It's just having a wide range. Yeah, Mark Hamill playing Joker. <laughs> oh, shit. What are these? I don't remember the next one. I don't even remember that one. Uh, oh, no, no. One. One, two, three, one. I thought it was one, two, three, one. One, three, two, one. Three, one, two, one. 
It's the top row. Two, one. Oh, I think that's right. Thank no, that's not right. I thought I typed that. What's the other one? I don't know the other one either. Uh oh. Guys, it's hero for. No, that's not it. That sounds right. Thank you. Thank you, guys. <laughs> no range. Okay. No range. Here, here's a comment from chat. No range is Jeff Shine with Carlos and Chris. So I like. Jeff Shine does a great job. Like, don't get me wrong. He does an amazing job. But hit. <laughs> Like, I feel like for his Chris and Carlos performance, they're just the exact same. Like, when, as soon as the trailer dropped for Village and Chris opened his mouth, I'm like, that's, e that's Carlos. Engaged. Adjust amount of solution to match cartridge capacity. Like, there's no way in hell that's not Carlos. Ethan, no. Yeah, and then there's some people that are just well known as like one character. I don't know what I don't know anything else that David Hater's in, but as Snake though. Why are you here? Go back to the subway station. I love voice acting though. Or I don't like I don't love voice act like myself. I just love voice actors. It's such a interesting career path, in my opinion. I actually Thank you, Sabato. Thank you so much. Ian, are you okay? Thank you, thank you. I don't know how to do this part anymore. I, I just oh fuck! I, I god damn it, dude! I just don't know. Like I'm pretty sure you do this, and then you look down. Maybe I, I don't fucking know, man. There. <sighs> 10 is the next uh, intentional damage I take. Why do I have so many knives? Can we do it on an IV? Yeah. Who left the freezer open? Totally. Open. I was worried about um not because of his voice acting. Uh I forget how to pronounce the name, Nick. Postalitis? I can't remember how to- the voice actor for Leon. He did such a fucking good job bringing RE3 to make Leon to RE4. Like... I, I shouldn't say I was worried. But it was definitely big shoes to fill, you know what I mean? Um, but him... Like, bringing Leon up to a more mature style was like, he did such a good job with that. Yeah, Nick's awesome. He's he's always been a huge fan of Ari. I just feel like it would ta take a lot of like training, like sitting in the mirror, or like just sitting on your bed and just practicing talking 
like so much training your voice just to be like, all right, a year has passed and I have to sound like five years have passed or 10 years have passed or 20. You know, I've, that seems like su such a hard thing to do. Yeah, Ashley, the voice actors for Ashley. Honestly, like every. <laughs> That's not. Uh, honestly, everyone in the RE engine. Besides, um, uh. Besides Ada. I think did amazing. Like, inarguably amazing. But Ada definitely can be argued. And then there's some more from Mario 4 Remake, honestly, that you can argue. But the only one that's a punch to the face is definitely Ada. Dario. I wonder who did Dario for RE3. Ah. I don't know. But the conversation's gone full circle. All my fault, by the way. I like how the game we got bit the most in is RE1. Or wait. Oh yeah, it's because they bite so often. Okay, so uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Oh shit! Okay, sorry, I'm just getting ready. All right, I have to take damage, and I will. Shit! Well... Alright, hit me. Uh-oh, you know what I'm taking damage from? This, I guess? <laughs> I thought I was gonna get slammed. No, 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 no! He's got berserk mode. All right. She's got a plan. Her name is Fox and thank you so much for the big old raid. How was your stream? Welcome everyone. Thank you solid fat for the 10 gifted subs and wrecking my butt. Yeah. Wait, I'm still in caution? Thank you, remove limit break! What were you up to, Foxan? Ask Foxan what your free promotional Mountain Dew. Alright. What about it? Attention. Self 
Oh, I can still get a heal. There's one heal here. But I won't use it from your yet from your request. How would you feel if you get contacted by Capcom to voice act an NPC in regame and it turns out an unlockable character for re outbreak remaster slash remake? That would stress me out. And it would have to pay a lot. Because I would have to stop streaming. I've asked been asked to voice act a few yes, indie games, but I've said no to all of them because um it was just it's it's too like I can't full time stream and do that shit. Bum bum bum. Bro. Yoink. Dun dun dun. dun. Thank you, Rundown Soup. Thank you so much. But that'd be amazing. If if uh, Capcom wanted me to voice something, I would much rather be a zombie. Just let me get one zombie moan in there. I'll make it perfect. What would I say? Brains. Something like that. I'm just kidding. Okay, now I'm healing. Dude, what was that cheap shot, broski? before the gifted sub promotion ends in four hours so I need to gift it before then we might be done in four hours I'm gonna use the little potty if you guys need me I'll be in the potty
Gators and gentlemen. Hey, everybody. Thank you, Foxan, for the raid. Have an awesome night. Yikes. S plus. All right. Wait. Okay. Biohazard. It all began as an ordinary day in September. An ordinary day in your ba da ba ba da ba de da de da de to here by the way you want to see gifted subs here they come You underestimate how much, how many zombie bites a OG RE3 run has, naturally. Especially a no reset run. September 28th, daylight. The monsters have overtaken the city. Somehow. I'm still alive. I'm still alive. <laughs> Railing a line of Adderall. I don't think that would do much to me since I have ADHD. But. Or, well, if you're snorting it, yeah, it's gonna do something, but. Ba-da-ba, ba-da-ba, da 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 No bites!
Yeah, it should have been Carlos. Why would Jill go to the RPD? That makes no sense. Wait, did I even... I didn't turn the grenade launcher mod on. Thank God we got it. You can never win yeah! with this fucking game. See, I told... I always say that about that one zombie. Like, I got the dodge and look what happens. Like, it's- it, you may as well just take the bite. I get the dodge, then I dodge Nemesis right after, and then you get bit anyway because you're- the game is bugged and it has an auto-dodge in play that makes it so you can't get bit after taking damage. But it just doesn't fucking work. Say goodbye here, fellers. Yeah, sushi. Sushi. But um, oh, and thank you, Rick Gamza. Thank you for the resub as well. How did he find me? How did he find me? This way. Bam! It's going epic, guys. It's going epic. Is Dark and Rose or Hurricane Chris in the chat? I need some I need some outbreakers stat for later. Not yet, devil. We still need about five thousand. We'll get there. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah, Isles. Jersey. But I'm a bump. No zombies. They all made the same sound. Un Thank you, Zero! Ba 
Oh god, if it was a zombie bite every gifted sub, I would be in bed right now. Jill, put this on. Because the stream would have ended about four hours and ten minutes ago. Beep boop. Beep beep boop. Beep doo 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 You know what? Maybe I'll have a zombie bite for you guys. You guys deserve one, don't you? You know what? Here, I'll take one. Here you guys go. How about this? Ah! <laughs> Three, three. No. Oh shit! Get down. Ian, are you okay? Thank you, keeping light for the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Did it too. That's five more. Look at zero making up his own rules. You silly goose. Dude, I don't even know how the fuck he got me because that line, that dot is just a straight line. Doing bites for five subs now? All right. Thank you, Edward. Don't forget to wish your enemies pleasant travels, Mr. Soup Man. Yeah, thank you, Resident Alligator, for the five minutes as well. Are you okay? All right, where's the next zombie? Thank you, thank you. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, little. Oh, Nemesis. Wow. I thank you, Keeping Light. Thank you, Ivan. Eisen. Thank you so much. All right, let's get our two bites. One second. Now, 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 now. They think they can kill me in RE3, huh? Dell's invincible in this game. Bum 
Yeah, it's gonna have to be hits in there, break because zombies don't bite you. What? Alright, that's it. I must have pressed shift by mistake. And it quits you out. Doesn't matter anyway. Nice. Hell yeah. I'll do some cooking streams this month. Some fall flavors. Pumpkin spice with chicken tenders. Mm. I made bakpa soup once on stream. Tell them. And we're off. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. He didn't turbo. No, I don't want that. Now I do. I love a big old pumpkin. Super Sleepy Tea is a pumpkin. What was that one soup I made? Oh god, I've streamed a lot of soups. I, I did make a butternut or peanut and butternut squash soup once on stream. Hear that zombie RNG. Uh, uh, oh. 
Yeah, make it super fun. If you know what I mean. Chop. Do -do -do -do. What the hell am I doing? Is that a zombie? Thank you, Fusion, for the zombie noises. You, you, you. Mikhail! Mikhail! Oh my god, Mikhail! He's roaring! Are out. It's useless. No. Sorry, oh. Carlos. No early powders. Oh, this game. <laughs> yeah, Jaguar Here's King. Here's a gift for you. Yeah. Sir, please. Nemi Roar. Oh, nuts. It's a four change. Sorry, I really like that note. What happens in 69 gift sub? Everyone in chat gives a sub right when it hits. So like, get your button ready. Because right when it hits 69, that's when everyone in chat all gives a sub. So we, we all come together and everyone 3,249 subs just come in right then and since you all do it on 69 that means you are going to have a 69 with someone in the next week it's going to give you extra luck sounds pretty good deal doesn't it Excuse me. Well, I don't know where my sheet is. My cheat sheet. What time is it? It's, uh, seven. I'm gonna just put in random things. I actually don't know what the solutions are without my notes. It's not this. 
But it might be this. It's not this. Uh oh. Fellas? Where's my RE3 cheat sheet? I need it. I need it. I need it. Old Bob. I, I never knew this puzzle. Ever. Not, not ever. <laughs> or not how to do it, but. It's no brain time. Here we go. Maybe. You're... Nah, there's... It's... It's RNG elegant. A lot of RNG. Do do... Do do... Just depends on what time's on the clock. Do 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 do. Happy Saturday, DJ. It's not Saturday Saturday for me anymore though. Probably oh. never run Parasite Eve ever again. I don't plan on speedrunning anything that's older anymore. Jill! Jill! October 1st, night. Night. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. Um, I have a little bit of a schedule up on Exhibitor schedule for October. It's at the bottom. I'm still working on it though. I was gonna do it all today, but uh, yeah, I, I was planning on doing this marathon October 1st. But I also thought that the sub -tober, September went to October 1st, and it doesn't. Uh, so... Yeah. I did the marathon today instead of all the other shit I gotta do. It's October! That's what happens every year. Oh, you doing the October stuff yet? Oh yeah, just gotta take a day off first. And that's where the problem comes in. A slight fracture. Just below the elbow. However, just below the elbow. Just below the elbow. Well, apparently it's supposed to be October, like today, blood siphon. I think. I have to double check. It says on the website, uh, x ray Mark Plush. It should say. I think. Just below the elbow. Good RNG. Hell yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice. That's awesome, Fox. I did watch Talk to Me. I was it was sick. I need to see the new Saw. It's been getting good reviews. Uh, 
TwitchCon is in Las Vegas. I will be going. It is this month. I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be like, hey, everybody. And everyone's gonna be like, oh my god. Fuck you! That's what they'll say to me, by the way, not not me to them. A few times, Dur Raymond. Am I giving autographs? No. No one wants my autograph. It's fucking terrible. It looks like shit. Yeah, I'm going to Sawcon as well, I think. Ah! Wait, that wasn't a bite! That I didn't take damage! That's it! Wait, but if we get to 69, everyone gives a sub. I forgot about that. You guys didn't forget, did you? Every oh my god, everyone gives a sub at 60. That's gonna be oh my god, that's gonna be crazy. Guys, that's gonna be insane. No, no movie, you said. <laughs> Oh my god. That, oh my god, this is gonna be so. Guys, really? No freaking way. That's insane. Wait, Devil May Eat Pie is gifting a hundred? Well, okay. Viewers are decreasing. No, come back! Guys, guys! I was just kidding. It's two gifted subs per. And I'm checking the viewer list. And I'm checking it twice like Santa would. for a while at the car. Okay, that's it. Excuse me, boys. What's a gaslight? I don't know about any of that, but we're almost at 69, 69 bytes and you guys know what that means. You promised. Yo, shooting ducks. That last fight didn't count. We're just gonna count it for fun, though. Yeah, Ren. <laughs> Guys. I fucked up. <sighs> oh, wait, wait. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I forgot. There's another. Oh, thank you, subs. Well, you're still going to have to do the one at 69, but thank you so much for the uh, current one, the freebie. Thank you. Really appreciate that. <laughs> no, I'm 100% kidding. Thank you, subs007. Thank you. He's just practicing. He's just warming up his finger. Do 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 do
All right, watch this. One cycle worm. I'm quite. In One cycle worm. Yeah, I really like the park music too. YOLO Carlos, one cycle worm, garbage everything else. You're starting to realize how much is missing from right through make. All you gotta do to realize how much is missing Stop. is besides Carlos at hospital, nothing, not a thing from the train crash to the end of the game is in, except Acid Nemesis, but it's so changed that it's unrecognizable. Oh, I'm just saying, for those who don't know, there's a lot of people that have never watched RE3. Every time I play this game, there's, there is at least like 10 people in chat who've never played or watched it. Um, but yeah, I'm not even kidding when I say nothing from the clock tower to the end of the game is in the remake. Besides Carlos. Which... If you would like to I compare that to RE2 Remake, it'd be like if in RE2 Remake, when you left the RPD the first time, nothing was the same. Do do do. Yeah! No sewer hunters. We're on the run. I don't know this either. Like, this is gonna take a while. Where are my RE3 passwords? I don't know where they went. On my desktop somewhere. It's faster if I just look it up. Uh. Maybe it's this. One sec. This is medium empty. I don't need RE3 passwords, do I? Well, seeing as I just said I did, uh, we're gonna go with yes. <laughs> yes, I do. Uh, this isn't it. Oh wait, no. Red is wrong. Um... This is still wrong. Red? There we go. Red is still wrong. Still wrong. Still wrong. There we go. Red's right. Uh, and now... 
Oh, yellow's wrong. Oops. Oh, no! Oh, it stays. Whew, thank God. Yeah, it's too late for the solution. Oh, no, it did change. Oops. Do, do, do. We did it. Beep. Beep boo boo. Beep boo boo. I've just never ever even tried to remember the clock puzzle or the water puzzle because I just why bother? I've I've had a for my Resident Evil cheat sheets for like five years straight. I just had a sheet of paper in front of me on my desk, sitting in the same place for like five years, coffee stains and all. So, yeah, that's why I don't remember. I remember everything from like every other game though. It's just RE3. Which is weird because it's the one I've played the most. Oh my god, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Four more, guys! Thank you, Dizzy. Four more! You guys have it do you guys have it ready? You guys have it, you guys are you guys Fellas? Stars? Am I ready to dust off my switch for what? For stars? Oh shit, Zop Dog, don't do it! Oh, he's doing the thing. Oh wait. He still got soaked. Oh no, thank you, Zop Doggy Dog. I mean, this isn't the lab. This isn't a lab show. It's not supposed to be a lab either. It's called the Waste Disposal Factory. misconception is people are huffing copium when it comes to the remake they didn't they didn't put they didn't change this area to make it better they did it to save money that's that's all there is to it that's like imagine re4 remakes score if the castle was lady dimitress's castle recolored They wouldn't do that to make it high quality. They would do it to save money. 
and that's exactly what they did. I'm not trying to rag on the game, I'm just telling you guys facts. Because I really, really, the only thing that will still get me to talk about RE3 Remake is when people are like, Oh man, this is great about the game. It's like, well, that's cool you enjoy it, but they did it to save a ton of money. <laughs> like, it's not like, it's, a lot of people think when someone's creating a game, like especially a AAA company, that they take these areas or these things and they're like, this is great, let's do this, it's gonna be so good. They're like, let's do this and hopefully no one cares and it'll save us a fuck ton of money. Oh, the dodge, the iframe dodge. Don't. Naruto or DBC? The very that you asking that very question means you prefer Naruto. Am I right? Bow, now, now. Is he dead, Skater? Yeah, one piece. Yes! I'll give you guys something to think about, about RE3 OG and RE3 Remake. RE3 Remake has every zombie from RE3 Remake just everywhere. RE3 Original has the cop zombies from RE3 Remake at the police station. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, I should have gave him stars. Bum, bum. Over here, here, here. And now we have a rather unfortunate. Yeah, I'm, I'm over the RE3 remake it topic. It's just so fucking dumb. Either get it or you don't. It's as simple as that. The president and federal council have ruled that the back of the is the best force. Thank you, Jerji, for the gift. It's a happy birthday, Big U Man. Oh, Big U Man, happy birthday. Our hearts go out to those poor civilians of Raccoon City. I think this is how it's in Twitch. I'm gonna have to alt tab and change it. Big U Man's got a big U heart. Oh, big ooh man, big ooh man, oh big ooh man, happy birthday, oh big ooh man. <laughs> That's all I'm doing. Thank you, Fox of Wasteland, for the gifted sub. Oh, yeah, let's go. Oh, yo, yo, let's go. Go, ho, ho, ho. 
Let's a go, ho, ho, yeah. Let's a go, ho, yeah. Let's a go. Mamma mia. Let's a go, ho, 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 ho. Let's a go. Ho, ho. Ba da bum, ba da ba da bum, bum, ba dum, ba dum, bum. Mamma mia. I closed the game. All right, all right, we'll see you next time. CVX time. What's he doing down there? Father! Oh, what do I play this with? Controller. Oh no, I'm gonna have to, I might have to relaunch it. Never mind. Bio wieners. Thank you, bees slays. Thank you, thank you. Do 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 Hey, thank you, thank you. Alright, this game is tricky for the gifted subs because everyone's gonna just assume every grab is a is a bite, but it's not. Pay close attention. As will I. Not a bite. Boom, oh, baby! Discount all of them as bites? You, the first one's free. Because ah! once you get to 69, this place is gonna fucking blow. Uh oh, 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 oh. Welcome! Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Um... There's nothing better than some Mary Jane and Bork Bar Soup. Don't bring your girlfriend into this! Uh. Thank you for the 420. And thank you, Please Eason. deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. Oh, to Veronica. Are there any Veronicas in the chat? That last zombie didn't bite me. He only grabbed. Oh wait, yeah, you can't slow to that. General, what are you doing? Thank you, General, for the five minute subs. We're gonna have to take another bite. And then it's gonna be 68, and then the, the whole Twitch is gonna crash. Twitch is gonna fucking crash. Are you guys saying 68? Are you referencing when the zombie grabbed me and didn't do any damage? <laughs> Kids these days. 
All right, guys. Is this a, was that? Did that count? Yes or no? Let's let's quiz the chat. There, that was that was for the that was for the gifted subs. Okay, that was my bad. Sixty nine. Oh, get down, everyone. Get down. Get down, everybody. Get down. Get. Oh, did the stream crash? Oh, never mind. Oh, it's all good. Oh. oh. Oh, well, uh, 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 um, uh, 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 um, uh, um, uh, um, and, uh, and uh happy bakto oh um uh uh freeman please deposit any metallic items in uh Um Oh Holy Thank you keeping light solid fat for the three gifted subs Eric with the five and uh, Satoshi uh, PJ with the two Fox, Sir Measley, Absolute Zero, Dirk, Libris, BB Sun, John, Jokers. Uh, thank you, Meats, for the for the five. Uh, thank you. Jokers, uh, thank you, Road King. RNG with the five. Leon, are you okay? Uh, Leon? Uh, 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 thank you, Rissa, for the resub. In a particular, particular way. Leafy Dude, thank you for the two. Uh, happy 69, everyone. We're, we're past it, but. Uh, thank you, PJ. Wafer Boy, thank you. Uh, uh, thank Leon with the, with the 10. Oh man, thank you, Keeping Light. Uh, uh, thank you, Player, Keeping Light, Didi. Thank you, Freeman, Generic, Platus, Crimson. Uh, 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 thank you, Blood Rush. Uh, uh, thank you. Uh, uh, thank you, Snake. Thank you, Emdo. Thank you, CJ. Uh, thank you, Irish. Th thank you so much. Thank you, Sushi. Uh, Zop Dog. Big Deku. Thank you, Hard Body Karate. Uh, uh, thank you, uh, Meats. With the five. Um. Oh, shit. Welcome. Uh. Th Mobile gifted aunt discounted sash. That's Bullshit! Thank you, Nubasaurus. Thank you, Lost Days, because I'm already... Uh, guys, I can't keep up. I can't keep up! We're almost at a million subs, I think. That's a lot of buckets thrown. Uh... Oh, I didn't miss shit. I actually counted like six extra. <laughs> uh, thank you. A very particular way. Thank you, Gajan. Thank you so much. Holy shit. CVX? CVX is always the worst to do this challenge with because people will see the zombie grab, even though it does no damage, and they'll be like, fuck, it's actually this number. It's like, oh boy. Oh, Anti with the resub and the 10 gift. Uh... Thank you. Yeah, we're. Uh, well, um. 
What's the, what do you what do you say when you're overwhelmed and can't read all the the, the alerts? Yeah! Help me. Uh Hey, I got the Wait for the sale. Wait for the sale. Mud Wolf. I am commander of this base. All right, guys, did that count? One's in the chat if it did, two's if it didn't. Who knows? Who knows? Let's see. No, oh, I. They don't read the fine. These people don't read the fine print. They don't read the fine print. Exclamation mark marathon. Jesus, you people. They're trying to milk me for all I'm worth. Thank you, chicken. Thank you, damage control. Dade. Thank you, lost days, cousin Mori. Thank you, fourth Garcia. Auntie, thank you again. Thank you, Leon. Keeping light. Lamer. Retcon. Wipe finger. Bud Wolf, Harry Warden, White Finger again, and the Silent Resident. Thank you so much, everyone. Oh, I have a headache. Zombie human. Is zombie human a dog? They didn't read the fine print, guys. Even though, now pay attention to this fine print. I count, out of the goodness of my own heart, I counted five zombie dogs biting me. Just for you guys. Just for you guys. Okay, let's read this. Mr. Soup is running Resil 123, 123 remake, 12 remake, uh, CVX Survivor. Uh, wait, wait, let me scroll up. And Outbreak. And gifting us up for every single zombie human bite takes damage to celebrate the last day of 25% off gifted subs! Thank you, Keeping Light, for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. And Blood Rush. Oh, my. Th forgiveness of Maximilian, dude. The dude. The dude. And Every single zamen, zamen. I lost my train of, of speech. The dude. No, he's not here. I wish, guys. Oh. A hundred. It's not even loading in. A hundred from some bench. All right, I owe you guys some grabs, I think, for that. Uh, 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 I owe you guys some grabs. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. Okay. We'll just count a few extra. I'm sorry it's so loud, Ouch. I can't turn down the volume. <laughs> sorry. Thank you for the 100 gifted subs! Holy shit! Thank you so much! Jeez. Jeez, 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 jeez. Thank you, thank you. Guys, I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed. I can't complete all these games. Alright, that just about does it. Thank you, Simbencha, for the hundred gifted subs. Jesus Christ. And thank you, Routes. I wonder when this is going to end. Whew. Thank you, Dusty. Thank you, Generic. Uh, Outbreak and Survivor are next. Thank you, Mango Madness, for the five good it says as well. Jeez! Oh my god. Ah! 
Leon, are you okay? Oof. I have the most annoying stream in the world right now. I apologize, everyone, if you're new. It's usually not like this. Well, my voice is still here, which might be annoying, but the alerts aren't. Thank you, Zopdog. Thank you, thank you. I am commander of this base. Thank you, Keeping Light, for the thousand five hundred. God, this is just every, every alert going off at once. I hope I have the health for this. Dude, did I heal? I don't even know if I healed. I hope I did. Nice, that's perfect. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, Haka! Haka! Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Nubasaurus, for the 200 bits. Thank you. Unforestero! Unforestero! That's a lot of buckets. Thank you, Dade, for the 100 bits. Soup troop. Guys, would you like me to turn the alert off, or are you are you living for it? I can listen to it all day, obviously, because they're my alerts. I made them so I could listen to them in my sleep. Thank you, Keeping Light. Bum, bum. Keep them on. We Keep need to suffer on. from success. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Keeping Light. Dun, dun. First Unforestero! Bum bum. Unforestero! Do do. Yo, stinky winky good boy, thank you for the five good subs. Thank you, thank you. Un forastero! The level 10 hype train. Holy moly's. My hype train, that's insane because my hype train is actually really hard to level. You choose how, how hard it is to level a hype train. Like you manually choose it. And mine's at like one of the highest it can be. Ouch. Thank you, Nubasaurus. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. Was Maximilian Dude actually in the chat? Yes. And we scared him. Great. Thank you, Simbetcha, for 59! Thank you, thank you, holy moly. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, 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 thank you. Thank you, thank you. Alright. Wait, about to beat your last record. There's a record? 
Oh, shit! Thank you, Kiko. Oh, guys. Alright, I, I owe... I owe some Mecha some... Uh, oh, I owe all you guys some zombie bites. Here. Ah! Ouch. Ah! Oh, that was two. Ah! He nibbled. Ah! Ouch. One more. Ah! I'm healing, though. Yeah, thank you, Baxter. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, man. Thank you, hunters, for the... Oh, my God. I'm going to end up dying. Leon, are you okay? Thank you, hunters. Holy shit. Streamer dab at level 11. Oh! Thank you, Javen, for the 20 gifted subs. Oh my god. See you around. Hey, all I uh, all we had to one, two, six. Oh my god, I'm drowning in We're drowning in, in emotes. Look! Send an eyes with the 10. Jesus Christ, thank you so much. And thank you, Rip, for the super chat. LOL. Oh, God, dude. Excuse me, things. Thank you for the gifted subs. Is Leon, Leon, I don't think Leon's okay anymore. My my muscle memory is guiding this whole round right now. Hey, what are you looking at? Thank you, Holiday Gray, and thank you to Hippos for the tier three and the twenty-seven. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, I think I owe you guys another you another around. couple bites now. But I'm gonna drop it a danger and then die. Just just you you have one. Ah! Uh, all right. Aka! Thank you very particular way for the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Leon, are you okay? Is he okay? Uh, I gifted it sub to T Pain. T Pain and Maximilian Dude are here? Holy shit, it's a. <coughs> it's a fucking. It's a party. My dreams are coming true. Wait, where'd the alerts go? Movie. Thank you for the 2,500 bits. Thank you, Nubasaurus. I think that alert messed up. Excuse me, la ladies. Oh, I have to take a bite for the chat. Ah! Thank you, everybody. Best save theme. Thank you, Mon Skelio. Thank you, thank you, who, 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 who,
Thank you so much for the crazy support. And some bencha, holy freaking shit! Thank you, Onyx, for the gift of sub to Zach Rar. Welcome. And thank you, Keeping Light. Oh, Asmund Gold was in the chat one time, only once. He must have gone on a Resident Evil kick. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. It stopped on the hour. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, thank you. Here, one for the homies in the chat. Come on. I was hoping he would grab my head, but he didn't. Thank you. Thank you. No, super puffy. He focused, brother. I don't know why you guys are typing one, but thank you, Routes. Oh, you're pouring ones out. I see. Beep boop. Guys, everyone who got a gifted sub, all thousand of you or whatever. What's your new favorite uh, uh, October emote? If you don't mind me asking. I'm grabbing this just in case. We'll take eight more bites. I've taken a ton of bites on purpose. <laughs> One sec. Yeah, I may as well take a few more. Where's the next zombie? <laughs> There's the people in the chat that have millions of channel points. No joke. This the guy won't leave by. Here's here's how to tell if you're in the top percentage of people with channel points in the channel. Did you watch you play Dead by Daylight? If the answer is no, you're not close. Thank you, Max. <laughs> Because why I say that is because we did a ton of predictions for Dead by Daylight. You only have 1.3 million. Oh, there you go. And Texas Chainsaw, I guess, too. Your favorite RE game of all time. Oh, nice. Well, that's awesome. Yeah, I... I, I, I like this game a lot, too. I actually played it when I was on Dreamcast back in the day. Oh, Alfred Ashford carries the game hard. <laughs> yeah, that one was those ones were for you guys. Those ones were for you guys. Uh, 
I had to think about what I was doing. Oh, those points mean nothing. If you guys type it in points, that I don't even know what the hell that shit is. That's some stream elements thing. Um, ba da 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 I think his name's Asmund Gold TV or something. Yeah, you guys could check other people's watch time. Isn't that nutty? <laughs> no mice critical. Three days. Ugh. Ugh. Ah! What happens with the subs at 420? We rip on it. Stupid turbo zombie. Seven ah! Ray. Six months? Hell yeah, Maximilian. Hell yeah. Ah. Uh, I'm doing the glitch, by the way. Did it work? It did. Pop, 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 pop. I'm glad I can give you guys months of entertainment, or literal months. Or days. Oh. Oh. This is the biggest dodge in the game, but if you don't get the first zombie... There we go. I was gonna say, if you don't get the first zombie, it's really way harder to do. 
The glitch I performed is uh, if you read your notebook or the play guide, like in the file selection area, it messes with whatever item is in the f like sixth slot or something in your inventory. Um, and so now my normal bow rounds are explosive rounds. And you might be thinking, what? That's so fucking stupid. You should do a legit glitch this run. Here's, here's the difference between the two runs. In this run, I have now changed my explosive rounds or my normal rounds into explosive rounds. In Glitchless, you take a few extra seconds and pick up, <laughs> or it's like two minutes, and pick up grenades instead and use those on the boss. Basically just making it so you're not picking up extra nades. The next slot after the file, but I... But nothing important was in that slot. I'm pretty sure it's the sixth item slot. Oops. Thank you, Stargazer. Oh shit, wait. This Wait, which one is it? One, one, two, three, four, five. It's the sixth one, yeah. Do, 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 do. Thank you, Stargazer. And thank you, Bach Donut. Thank you, everyone, for the insane. <sighs> well, I can't go on the stairs because there's a zombie on the stairs. I was like, what's going on? I tried to go down and it wouldn't let me. Because if a zombie is climbing the stairs in this game, you can't go on there with him. You have to either wait till he gets to the top or shoot him. Well, the the R CVX and RE3 were being developed at the exact same time. So that's why there's like a, a mix of weird mechanics like why is this so good in RE3 but so bad in CVX? Clear. And vice versa. Like in CVX, you could push zombies off you um, get to that indefinitely. Well, unless they turbo. And so you know how in RE3 you could push zombies off? This will blow some of your minds. In this game, if you get grabbed by a non-turbo zombie, then you can push them off and you don't take any damage. In RE3, you can also push zombies off without taking damage, but you have to have already been bit in that room. So let's say you're in the basement and you get grabbed by the first zombie. You cannot, 100%, cannot shake them off unless you take damage first. But then let's say you get bit by any zombie after, then you can push them off without taking damage. Um... Uh, where'd... Oh, it's this way. Oops. Um, ah! Shit! So, but as soon as you go to the next room... So, let, let's say you leave the base, but you go to the next room, like the alleyway. Then it resets. Like you have to get grabbed again to get to push off another zombie again. So unless you get grabbed in that specific room, you can't push zombies off. Oh, 
Hey, thank you, Dusty. Yo, Pavlox. No, it's not the end of the game. Like the halfway point. You'll wish it was. Now first we have to come back and do the exact same shit we just did as Chris. So we have to change our player model and redo everything. And then... Uh, yeah. God, I hope in in RE CVX remake, when it inevitably comes, for the love of God, separate the Claire and Chris scenarios. I'll make it such a better game. They need to trim the fat, yeah. Thank you, Mirog. But I think that I think they definitely will uh, split the scenarios if they remake it. Thank you, Maddie, and thank you, Mirog. Minutes. minutes until detonation. Shit. Yeah, that's a that's obvious too, Lolu, for sure. You should just share an item box and share an inventory. I just think the game would be better received and just a better game if the scenarios were split and fleshed out in that way. I'd rather a game like RE3 RE2 remake, sorry, than but the scenarios are like really good. Rather than RE3 Remake, where it's just going to be cut to hell. By the way, if they did remake this game, I 100% expect it to be more like RE3 Remake. Because if, like, this game reuses a lot of areas, so... In a remake, they shouldn't reuse all the areas because it's just not, it could be much better. You know, why, why revisit the same area with the same enemies and the same thing to do when you can make something new? And I don't mean to backtracking, I mean just in this game, I, I, what? Okay, I don't even know why I'm going down this road. I started this stupid topic. This game is beloved by some and hated by others. Like this is the most, this is just like, Zero, except people love it. Um, but the the major problem with this game, in my opinion, is the retreading. I think the the Arctic base 
6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. I think the Arctic base revisit as Chris is great. Like it changes so much that it's pretty cool and most of it's new. But the revisit to the island, like this area as Chris is like, oh, don't like that. But I, I love the game by the way, don't get me wrong. But. Definitely think as a remake they could improve a lot. Backtrack is only an issue for people with low attention span. Well, I mean, I, I disagree. Since if you go the wrong way in like Resident Evil One, like you know what you're supposed to do when you like go to a door and it's like you need the armor key and so you're not going to go back to that door until you get the armor key or like back in the day you'd write it down you'd be like all right need the armor key for this side of the mansion whatever when you go the wrong way in cvx you don't exactly know what you're supposed to get when you go back sometimes and if you go the wrong way in cvx it feels terrible because this out of all re games this is the one that takes the longest to get around in it might not seem that way right now because i have door skip on but door skip is a mod without door skip if you go the wrong way it's terrible and especially if you go the wrong way twice it's just so punishing like you're you're one re i think the main reason cvx is known to be a long game is quite simple most people get extremely lost in this game and if you want to get unlost it takes the most time to get unlost of any resident evil game in the mainline series without a doubt this area is much more straightforward but the first area the prison section as claire is not straightforward at all it's just like, it's a little frickin' sandbox. And if you go the wrong way, I hope you enjoy the scenery because you're going there three times. And well, regardless, if <laughs> you have to, it's mandatory to visit the cathedral or the uh, castle twice or like the mansion. And some playthroughs are visiting it like four, five, six times. Regardless if you think to yourself like I would never do that players do it and it's just a thing And it's no better when you go back as Chris either it's Sort of the same thing except you you don't have to go to the I'm just sharing my own opinion by the way. I Just expect this re a remake of this would go one of two ways they would split the scenarios up and flesh out both of them. Or they'd go the RE3 remake path and they would keep it exactly how it is. And it might not feel that great. Why I do think they'll RE3 this game is simply because like it's in their benefit to do that. But again, like I said, this game wasn't super well received by the fans. So remaking it and not changing anything would do like the Turbo fans great justice, but anyone new to the franchise might not enjoy it as much. And yeah, they, I mean, they might even cut <coughs> Chris's revisit to this island to and totally. It's tough to say. That's all just speculation. They're not even, as far as we know, they're not even remaking this game, but. I would love big changes for CVX. I think it, it, the, the. This game is ripe for a remake. 
Like, there's so many things that could be improved. And I don't mean that as if, like, oh, this game sucks. They could, oh, you know, fix all this garbage parts. I mean, there's just, like, there's so many, so many good ideas in this game. And so many cool locations that can be just altered slightly or changed. And it'd be amazing. Like Steve. Yeah, imagine Giga Chad, Steve. How's this? How'd your runs go, Hazeblade? I didn't actually like CVX. Um, well, like, I liked it when I played it on Dreamcast, but I replayed it when I started streaming, and I hated it. I did a sub incentive uh, years ago. And the, the reward was running CVX. And once I learned the game, like learned where to go and when to go there, I liked it way more. Like I found it. And that's why I have the opinion I have. Because I hated the game when I didn't know where to go. I thought it was so boring to replay and shitty. And then once I learned where everything was and when and where to go places, uh, I loved it. Like I enjoy myself with this game every time now. Because I know where to go. Getting lost sucks. Yeah, exactly. This game's super fun when you replay it. And I know the arrow glitch, yeah. Yeah, that helps. Okay. The arrow glitch isn't useful, though. See? But now, the by the way, now when you're switching to Chris, the glitch is gone. I was supposed to give Chris the fucking crossbow. I am terrible. And now, here's the biggest problem with CVX. And I just inflicted it upon myself. Here's the actual main reason people don't like this game or had a bad experience with it. Now the crossbow's gone forever. Huh? Love that. Love that shit, dude. Yeah, I know. It, it's actually baffling. It's hard to tell what they were thinking. Like... Because you, you can completely fuck yourself over in this game. Just due to that one thing. It doesn't tell you that you're switching characters. And it doesn't let you know at all that there's like an inventory system in this game. It's just like... Surprise! <laughs> you... Oh! You were fighting a boss as Claire and you decided to take your whole inventory with you? Well, got news for you. Chris is gonna be fucked. Do -do -do -do. Yeah, but something like that, like there is absolutely no way they'd ever remake this game and keep that kind of thing in there. Like it's just, it's a not possible because it's such a major design flaw. So like that's an obvious thing they would fix regardless of if they split up the chapters, like made a Chris scenario and a Claire scenario, you would definitely share an inventory. Or they would balance the game around not showing an inventory, one of the two. But this game is not balanced around that. It's balanced around you knowing something that you can't know. Yeah, exactly. You've received all Claire's items like a normal game.
I mean, if you if you disagree with sharing inventory, then you're just you're you're satisfied with like player A gets completely fucked, hates the game, and quits it and returns it and uninstalls it. Player B gets the grenade launcher, the explosive rounds, the shotgun, yada 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 yada. Gets gets everything and has a great time. Amazing. Because that is how this game was when it came out. Some players despised it and others absolutely adored it. Well, the, the real problem, Slime, is, is this second switch. When you switch back to Claire, like when you save Claire, no player is going to think to themselves, all right, I'm only, I'm switching back to Claire for five minutes. Everyone and their grandma is going to think, all right, we're going to fight the last boss as the main character of the game, but they goof you. They, you can switch to Claire. It gives you an item box <laughs> and not a typewriter. Then you put all your, you take all your items because you think you're playing the main character again. And then the game reverse Uno's you five seconds later and is like, yeah, just kidding. You're switching back to Chris right away. Oh, you took all the items out of the box? Well, how about this? Fuck you. The fact that it gives you an item box and no typewriter is like the biggest oversight and troll ever. It's so brutal because the game is basically telling you Take the items out of the box. It's here for you. It's like, but you want to save it? No, no, no. Finish what you're doing, then you can save it. And on top of that, like... <laughs> when... I'm not trying to hate on the game. I, I like CVX, but I'm just telling people why other people don't like it. And, like, things that can be easily fixed. What's the first thing you do when you switch back to Chris? Like, this whole- the whole circle of things I just explained is just bad. It's simply bad game design. It's simply not well made. You play as Claire, you think you're the main character, you take all your items out, you don't fight- you fight an invincible boss that you can't kill, so you gotta figure that out if you try and fight it. It's impossible to kill. But on top of that, so finally you figure out that it's impossible to kill, even though you have all the good items on your character, the general player does. And what are you greeted with right after the midst of the boss? It immediately switches you to Chris, and you're in a boss fight. You're in a boss fight. You are fighting a boss already. And, but, but the kicker is, you probably don't have anything in your inventory because you assume you're going to play as Claire for the rest of the game. So Chris is standing there naked, staring at a boss fight. And regardless of if you're thinking to yourself, your anecdotal experience, that didn't happen to me. I've watched it happen to streamers on Twitch. Anyway. Those are the reasons that people don't like this game. This is not the proper way. One sec. My, my CVX rant is done with. But again, I just want to say... I don't hate this game. I'm explaining why other people do. That's all. It's just, it's unfortunate, because it is a, it's a great game. But depending on... The random choices you made, you might have had a bad or good experience. That's it. I had the same problem with, uh, or a, a slightly same problem with Tomb Raider 4. Not with the inventory thing, but not knowing where to go in that game can make it horrible. If you go the wrong way, like multiple times, it is so punishing. Like just, it's brutal. But when you go the right way, the game is great. 
some games just have that whole setup where going the wrong way is just like horrible. I, Cause Tomb Raider 4 is right up my alley. It's got the whole Egyptian setting. I love that stuff. Um, and I just love Tomb Raider in general, but I really didn't like that game. But I do know if I replayed it, I would like it a lot more. A lot of my, uh, a lot of the sad moments with, with that were just getting lost. And then finally chat's like, yeah, you got to run half an hour in the other direction. I was like, oh, okay. Sick. I guess I'll do that. What's a game like that for you guys? That you feel like the second playthrough is way better than the first? Dark Souls, boom, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 1, BOOM! Dark Souls, I, Dark Souls 1, I'd feel that same way about. I really didn't like my first playthrough. And it's not that I got stuck on any bosses or anything. I just didn't like it very much. Uh, and then when I replayed it, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, Riley, yeah, for sure. The fire extinguisher. The game is just sort of built that way, where it's just punishing for not knowing what to do. But it's also ironic because it has no replay value. So, if you're gonna- and, and that- I want to stop talking about it, but the plot keeps thickening. It's like, if you want to do things like that in your game, it's great to have good replay value. But it's- it's so funny, like, up to this point, up to CVX, every Resident Evil had great replay value. And then they make one that punishes you heavily for not knowing what to do, but also gives you an idea that you could be rewarded for knowing that thing in your next playthrough, but it doesn't have like an extra ending or a ton of costumes or any like big reason to replay. It's just like, it's just sort of a fuck you. No, I've never, I didn't get around to running the remake or I, I tried it for a bit, I think. Actually, I, I did try it for a little bit. Ugh. Ugh. Jesus, this guy's ruthless. So wait, is there no costumes in this game? I actually don't know. But I do know... Uh, there's some results screens for the mercenaries or for the extra battle mode that have some really cool costumes. Or, I know the Claire one in like full red latex. And then the Chris fishing. Uh, ah! We're almost at a hundred. One more. One more and we're at a hundred. That, when we get to a hundred, that means everyone in chat that's not subbed has a chance to get a sub. Double it and give it to the next stream. Yeah, a lot of weird choices in this game. Hmm. All right, we have the strongest uncommon enemy in the franchise, a hunter. Now, what can we do to spice it up in our new Resident Evil game? I know. Make it poison you <laughs> on top of the damage. <laughs> like, you know, you could have just added a poison enemy. 
I think poison hunters are cool, but you know what I mean though? It's just like, that's what you come up with? You take the strongest, hardest hitting enemy, like the scariest enemy in the franchise arguably up to this point, and you just make it poison you. Like... Okay. There's a lot of poison in this game. I think this game has the most poison- now that I put any thought into it, I think this game has the most poison in any RE. Never really thought about that till now. But that's pretty funny. Yeah, and the moths just spew poison. Like, they're just constantly poisoning. RE Outbreak does have a lot- RE Outbreak has so much bullshit status effects. Bleed is so bad in that game. If they remade Outbreak... I, I don't think they had have to take care- take out bleed, but they have to make it so specific enemies can make you bleed, not just like chance on hit to die. Oh yeah, and the Nosferatu! Yeah, that's true. Yeah. And that actually heavy, heavily affects the game. Dude, I do like all the mini bosses in CVX. Even though you could just run away from them. See ya. Do, 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 do. It, it's also funny that, like, uh, it gives you no reward. <laughs> There's no reward for killing the boss. It's just like, all right, 20 grenade rounds later, he's dead. What's my reward, baby? Nothing. Anyway, I've been shitting on the game for a while. This game has, like, the best soundtrack of any... Resident Evil. It's also one of the only Resident Evil games with a story. That's beyond like... There's a lab. There's a virus. But the story- there is a story about some people. It's definitely back and forth for some people. There's a Steve. I would, with all this being said though, I would fucking love a remake of this game. It could be so damn good. I feel like this is Chris at his prime. Like imagine this Chris in the RE engine. That'd be so sick. Ethan, no. Same with Claire, like a slightly older Claire and a slightly older Chris. I would love that. God, I would love to see this game. I'm so pumped to see what's next for Ari. I think most, uh, I should say most, but I definitely think it's smarter for them to remake this than five. M maybe not financially, but uh, it does hype up Wesker a lot. Because right now for new for like fans of the franchise that got in on RE Engine games, which is a large portion of people, uh, they don't know much about Wesker. Like in the RE Engine timeline. Oh, I'm Oh, oh. 
Oh, he turboed too. Get off of you, fuck. Yeah, Haze Blade, for sure. I think it's the perfect perfect time to remake CVX, just to show off Wesker. Thank you, Dusty. You could even they could even go as far as to give Wesker his own scenario. Similar to separate ways, but playing as a villain. I need uh, I'll take You guys might be surprised by me saying this, but I'll take ah! every Resident Evil they want to throw. RE9, 10, 1 remake, 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 CVX remake, 5 remake. The only one that I. Uh, zero. Like. Oh, 100, baby! Let's go! I didn't notice. 100, baby, 100. So I want to thank the chat. The zombies, uh, you know, um, Mamma Mia. That brought me to caution. Mamma mia! Uh, I can't remember this. Oh uh, no, what is it again? No. Uh, I can't remember. Heart, crown, AA spade. Oops, no, no. No, that's not the way. This is it. Thank you, Pavlox. Oh, Alfred, commander of this base. I need to get these subs before 4 o'clock my time, so before outbreak. Um, cuz... Uh, they're taking the... The gifted sub discount away in two hours. I think at least their website said four or said 12 ET. Or 12 AM PT and it's now in PT. It's uh, what like 10? Something. Deep boo. Thoughts on Counter-Strike 2? Um, I haven't really watched much for it. What are people thinking about it? <laughs> I 
This is, yeah, I watched a little bit and I'm like, hmm. The water effects and the smoke. Let's go. I used to love Counter-Strike, but it's such a competitive game, you know. Bum, bum, bum. I never really got into CSGO. I've played it hundreds of hours of Source, maybe even upwards of a thousand. But... I find it hard to play competitive games unless I'm actually, like, religiously playing them. And if I want to religiously play a game, Nowadays, it's got to do well on stream as well. And Counter-Strike ain't doing well on any stream unless you're a Counter-Strike professional. All right, so here's what I was talking about earlier. So you, so a normal player, your average player is going to give all items to Claire here, all right? And then you're going to go get the items from the box. There's the grenade launcher, the shotgun, everything, and then you're gonna- Because you're thinking, you're like, alright, this is the end of the game, I'm back to the main character, the character I started as. Let's go beat the game. But what happens is you take all this stuff, you go fight an infamous boss that kills everybody. You finally get by that part, thinking- Some players think it's fucking a pot. Like, when I first started running this game, you wouldn't believe how many players, or how many viewers would be like, Oh my god, did you just beat Steve first try or holy shit, you did that no damage, I've never seen that. Like, because people would fucking get stuck on him. And it's just a corridor you run through, that's it, but it's hard to understand that at first. And I'm guilty too, by the way. Um... So, you finally beat this boss, and then as soon as you, like, you'll see, as soon as you beat the boss, you're in a boss fight as Chris. Like, you're, you're in one. Literally. I mean, not literally inside of the boss, but... I'm grinding Reavers. Grinding Reavers! What have, I, what have I been doing in my spare time? I started One Piece. That's about it. Thank you, Alfaro. Give him the old slip. Go, oh, baby! The show. And then boom, right away, you're 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 fighting a boss. Now, you you guys understand what I mean now? How many players did this happen to? They they're at the boss. They finally kill Steve. Finally, then they're in a boss fight with a na a nude inventory, no items. And then, don't underestimate your average player's annoyance with a singular video game. They say, I fucking hate this game. They turn it off and they never play again. And from that point onward, when someone asks about CVX, they say they hate it and it sucks. That is a lot of CVX haters. Ah! We've all been there. If you're a gamer, you've had those moments where you're playing a game, whether or not it's good or bad, but it has frustrated you so much that it finally does something really frustrating and you, you're you just like, fuck this garbage. You don't care if your friends love it, if it's got good reviews, you're just like, fuck this shit. And if anyone asks, it's personal. Oh, that game? Fuck that game. Yeah, see, look, they got their game. Look, Last of Us 2, Destiny, Ninja Gaiden, Red Dead 2. There you go. I'm trying to think of what 
that what that was for me. Silent Hill 4 for me, actually. It was the first game in in a October ever that I quit and I didn't play again. It was the first game ever. It's it's all the fours for me. Silent Hill 4, Tomb Raider 4, Resident Evil 4, or this is technically four. Threes? Oh, the, the, when it cuts, when it has the number three, fuck yeah, dude. Silent Hill three, Metal Gear Solid three, Tomb Raider three, Resident Evil three. Hell yeah. But when it gets to that four though, it's but it's the renamed fours. It's Silent Hill the Room. It's Resident Evil Code Veronica. It's Tomb Raider the Last Revelation. Do, 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 do. I don't mind Silent Hill 4 anymore. I ran the game for a while. Oh, I'm talking about CVX, not RE4, but... For, code for Veronica, yeah. But why I quit uh, Silent Hill 4, I, I forget the specific reason, but it was just annoying the hell out of me. Like, I really didn't like the first four areas, and then... Then second half of the game is the first four areas again, except you're escorting someone. And I was just like, man, like I was so I, I remember in my first like attempt of a playthrough, I was so excited every time at the end of a level, like at the end of the subway, I'm like, I can't wait to see the next area. And then I see the next the water tower. I'm like, OK, this area sucks, too. All right. I can't wait to see the next area. It's going to be fucking awesome. Then it's the like monkey jungle or the forest is the secondary actually. I'm like, all right, I can't, so you know what I mean? And then finally at the hotel or at the apartment, I'm like, all right, I can't wait to see the next area. And what's the next area? It's the old areas. I'm just like, are you fucking kidding me with this shit? Except now you're escorting Ash, uh, an Ashley type character. It's like, Jesus Christ, man. But with that being said, just like Code Veronica, just like Tomb Raider 4, um, when I watch Silent Hill 4, like when I watch someone that knows what they're doing, I... Dude, wait, where's the item box? Oh no, we need an item box. I don't know where one is. Oh wait, is it in the room right beside me? This is just a typewriter. This game and it's like separating the item boxes and typewriters for some reason. Well, we'll try without it. But I would have liked the crossbow. Oh wait, there's one right beside us. Yeah, watching so I think Silent Hill 4 has a great story. You fucking. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. What? Hey, one thing I stick up for for Saddle Four with is when people talk about like, oh, this is so PT. The only reason PT, uh, this is how I see it. Agárralo! PT is just basically the Silent Hill 4 apartment as a game. Thank you, Angelic Lynn. Thank you for the raid. What were you up to? Welcome, everybody. Or not so much the Silent Hill 4 apartment, but like that's where it all started with the Silent Hill franchise going like first person and doing a bunch of weird shit, trying to scare you. And then PT put it in overdrive, or that idea. Where you just revisit the same place over and over and stuff changes. Um. Oh, hell yeah, Lynn, hell yeah. Banner. 
Yeah, I love all the stuff that happens in the apartment in Silent Hill 4. The code is Veronica. This facility Who got stuck here? Anyone in the chat? Five. It's been it's been crazy all epic. Oh yeah, I got bit. <laughs> Yeah, I beat the whole thing, San. Boing! Beep boop beep beep boop beep beep boop beep boop beep boop beep. This boss is just RNG incarnate. <laughs> Everything about it, even this part. She has to fly into the bullet here. So in the speed run, you just shoot it forward. Like I'm doing the speed strat. There it is. Oh, oh really, Benio? Oh! Thank you again, Lynn. Make sure to follow Angel Glenn. Epic Canadian streamer. Chris, uh... move. Claire. Oh. No! Move. Move. All right, enjoy the ending. I'll be right back. Move. Chris! <sighs> well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker! You don't want her. Fine. Claire! Today's a good day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia... Gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? Steve. In his body, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Maybe he'll come back alive, just as I did, and be able to see your sister again. You freak! Don't you touch him! I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken him. Get out of here, Claire. But what about? As a surviving member of Stars, I have to finish this. Remember your promise. I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who you've killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. Like, no. 
magnificent, don't you think? Nice try, Wesker. Today's your lucky day. Next time we meet, don't count on another. Next time. Until we meet again. <laughs> that I always keep my promises. <laughs> Chris, promise me. Please promise that you won't leave me alone again. I'm sorry, Claire, but it's not over yet. There's still something we've got to do. You mean... Yeah, it's payback time. We've got to destroy Umbrella. Now. Let's finish this once and for all!
Don't cry, everyone. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Can't do it that fast. Da, 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 da. This game has the best Wesker. Before we make Wesker did say billions. <sighs> the Andy route. No. I've already been streaming for almost eight hours. It's just I pause my timer a lot. All right, fucking step on it, Broski. The credits and cutscenes count to the total time. Feels bad, man. Bow, no, 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 no. All right, enough of. I'm sick of playing shit games. Trying to play some good shit. Computer, boot up that good shit. Boot up that good shit. <clears throat> boot up that good shit. All right, there we go. Sorry. <laughs> oh, boy. <clears throat> Bam. Now. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're going to be hearing that a lot this month, probably. We're playing some Signalis tomorrow. We're playing some Haunting Ground, some Clock Tizzle 3, some Dizzler D, some Pizzler P. Oh man, strap in. Get your strap on and strap in. Because we're playing Resident Evil motherfucking. Resident Evil Survivor. Resident Evil. They made sure you knew the word they were saying. Resident Evil. <sighs> Damn right, Resident Evil. <laughs> That's way too fitting. Ugh. 
<laughs> you, oh, resident you look familiar, evil. but oh, uh, mm. but I just can't remember. You just can't remember. Mark Tuck Thompson, huh? Though I can't remember anything, I know that this was no way for anyone to die. What? What? I love that instant replay. <clears throat> thank you, Elite Shadow Man, Dr. She, Spicy Tuna Racy, thank you, Hot X Mix, thank you, Resident Evil. Zombie zombies eating buttholes. Yo, do, 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 do. Resident Evil. Survivor. <gasps> Guys, who's ready to carry me an outbreak? Anyone in the chat? Who's got outbreak booted up? Where's Hurricane Chris and Dark and Rose? Oh, we don't need to go in there. <clears throat> you got plenty of time to fix it, Hazeblade. Solo? You know, just for you guys, I'll count the grabs in this game. Because I, you get, I won't be getting bit, most likely. You wanna know how to get out of a grab in this game? Watch, I'll show you. You just hold in the button. I'll count it. Fuck ah! it. Sometimes they get you, but. This game is worth like $2,000. Or I mean like retail price or no. I mean, it's worth like if you know what? <sighs> Liquor hit equals a thousand subs. Remember your mission. We're doing a clean sweep of the area. Everyone and everything must be cleansed. Let's -a go. Let's -a go. Remember your mission. We're doing a clean sweep of the area. Everyone and everything must be cleansed. Now move out. This is it, soldier. <laughs> Move out and draw fire, soldier. Shh, listen to him breathe at the end. Move out and draw fire, soldier. <laughs> I never noticed that until now. Uh, What's that? Uh, mm, da -da -da. Move out and draw fire, soldier. <laughs> Oh my god, when I mentioned One Piece earlier, someone said how far I am. I just got to the time skip. By the way, that was like half an hour ago. But... Dino Crisis poster! Oh! <clears throat> Nice emotes, Red. Dino Crisis, that's what I want. Dino Crisis remake, baby. Getting hit in this game is hard to do. <laughs> Ooh. 
The only things that can hit you every time are hunters. Hunters are like impossible to dodge. Everything else in the entire game is a pushover. Dead Rising 1 remake. Dead Rising 1 on the RE engine. And I don't mean over the shoulder shooter like like RE2 remake or anything. But Dead Rising... Stupid Cap... Why does Capcom make so many games that are good for remaking? But Dead Rising would make an amazing remake, I think. The games I want remade the most are Outbreak, Parasite Eve, and Dino Crisis. <clears throat> what mobile game? Was that recently? I just like dinosaurs too. Oh, sick, Ace Blade. Wish I was on that map. Alright, what RNG are we gonna get? Is every zombie gonna be on the ground, standing up, or a mix of the two? They're all on the ground. Good RNG. <laughs> uh, yeah, we need our E-Guiden remake. Good looking horror tales going soon. Alan Wake 2 is the only like notable one. Oh, look, they're standing up now. Some of them. Ah! Oh shit, I gotta drop that sub bomb real soon, failers. Real soon. Yeah, I'm excited for Alan Wake 2. I hope it's good. I hope the gameplay is fun. That's about it. Like, I don't care if the story sucks ass. I just want it to be a fun game. I'm not saying that, like, I'm not, I don't care about the story, but I just, I just hope it's fun. I think Alan Wake 1 had a good story. But it's gameplay sort of got old by the end. So I, I hope too is stay as fun, you know what I mean? Fights for allies, so oh, buddy. Hey, pay it junior gaming. Beep boop beep boop beep 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 boop beep boop beep boop beep boop beep beep boop. Oh, I love it, Dirk. One Piece has been amazing. It's it, it's been shocking, actually. I just expect I I don't know what I expected, but it's really good. Like um, what are those two arcs? Um, Annie's Lobby and um, what's the other one called? Marine Ford are two of the best seasons I've ever seen of a of an anime. But all, everything from Water, Water 7, Annie's Lobby, uh, Impel Down, and then Marine Ford are like just four like absolute god tier arcs of anime. Oh shit, they hit someone! Do you have to be a weeb to enjoy One Piece? Um, I don't think so. Oh, I've been watching the edited version. So like, I'm watching a- I was watching One Pace, and then I'm just watching someone's random edit on Reddit. So I haven't seen a single filler episode yet.
And I don't want to either. Dude, if you go on Internet Movie Database and you look up One Piece, you'll see like the canon episodes and some of the, it's like, it's like 9 out of 10, 8 .5, 8, 9.5, 9.5, 9.6, 9.3, 9, 8.5. And then you'll look at the filler and it's like 5, 4, <laughs> 5, 6. <laughs> Just like, no thank you. Like it's, the reason I don't mind skipping it is it's clearly not as good. And that show has a lot of flashbacks and I, I've i read that the filler has a lot of flashbacks too. But. Like honestly, maybe when I finish the anime, I'll go back and watch like some of the filler seasons and stuff, but but yeah, I watched the the Netflix show and then I watched the anime. Hello, can you hear me? Who are you? Wh what are you doing? Answer me! I st I started at I started at ah! Jesus Christ! I started at Skypea though. I skipped everything until Skypea. Because I watched the show, and the show covers up to a bit before Skype, yeah. I did miss one of the best arcs, though. Feels bad. Whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called, but there is one really good arc before that. Alabasta, that's it. And Arlong Parker, here's really good. Yeah, I'm gonna go back and watch Alabasta, eventually. We got the best arc right here. True, baby! Drew! Ah! Bam! Oh, I know I missed a lot. I didn't mean to skip it. I was watching with someone. What? Vincent? It's me, your mother. My mother, other, 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 other. Vincent, please. Listen to your mother. I want you to leave Umbrella. I want you to stop performing those terrible crimes and just come back home. Just come back home, Herc. Please. Stop committing those terrible crimes. Please, Herc. Please. This is such a weak story. You take that back. What time we start a box over tomorrow? Uh, news to me. <laughs> Sometime when I wake up, this marathon. Dude, I need to get back on a morning schedule desperately, but I can't stop streaming. And fuck, dude, I'm so behind on everything in my whole life, but I just can't take a day off. I had three sponsors lined up this week and, and then separate ways, it's like, you know, separate way, I can't emphasize enough. Separate ways couldn't have come out at a worse time for me. It was fucking horrible timing. And so now I'm just, my life is sort of fucked, but yeah, I'll be, I'll be doing Bok Tower tomorrow. I'll be playing Signalis and I hear Signalis might take more than one stream, so. Or will it? Uh, like nine out of ten mantis it's fucking awesome i love i love separate ways it's so good it's as good as it could be i think like i could i can't see them doing a better job like obviously if there was more areas and newer weapons and stuff it'd be better but it's way better than i expected it to be yeah that's the thing if 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 several ways just was like some crappy dlc i would have ran it for like a day or two and then never played again but it's just been so fun and getting to dress Ada up and all the different mods? How can you stay away? Woohoo! Oh, listen to those drums.
They went all out on this game. Oh my god, I don't think I'd ever play any game with a nude mod. That would make me so uncomfortable. I would feel like I lost a part of myself. Like, who am I? Like, what is... what? a guy with the nude bot in a Street Fighter tournament? Dude, I wish there was a Kami skin and a Chun-Li skin and or like mod for Ada in separate ways and Jury. I'm shocked there isn't yet. It makes me sad. Ah! Yeah, I want to play those too, Raven. I hope I can get them working. Oh, that'd be amazing. That'd be Dude, this game is loud as shit right now. Get away from me, Hunter. Excuse me, I need to go in there. Is this a fan game? Bruh! Bruh, back off! This is a full price Capcom Resident Evil game. No, Bachbot, take that back. Yeah, this deserves a remake. Screw CVX and Dino Crisis, whatever else. <sighs> remake Survivor, Browskis. This is the worst room in the game, by the way. Oh, but we just made it perfect. That's what it should have said at the end of this game. It should have, like, big sound effect, like, da da! Ark Thompson will return. <gasps> hey, asshole. <laughs> Guy hit me with the back of his hand. Bruce McGilvern? Wait, what's it? It's McGilvern, right? I don't even know why I knew that. Um. Yeah, Dead Aim. I don't think Dead Aim. Like, the virus in Dead Aim turns the guy into a girl. It's like. Uh. I think it, I think that aim should probably stay right where it is. Holy shit, I'm getting good RNG here. This guy is just pushing me. Look at this. He's taking me all the way. That sound effect you hear was a guy rolling into me, pushing me further and further and further. Sure did. A black tiger. 
<laughs> I like <laughs> every model in this game is just reused. Like that's literally Black Tiger. Like, I, he, people tell me every time I ask, so this game was a full price game. Because if so, it's like fucking hilarious. I'm almost positive it was. My brother bought it too. Um, and it's just, it's, regardless if it's, if it's over $20, like people say separate ways isn't worth 10. Like, this game is just straight up just reused asset. Like that's the zombies from, from the RE2 lab. The IVs right here are from RE2. The liquors are from RE2. <laughs> A lot of the assets are from RE2. Like... No, well for sure, the game has a lot of replayability. I love this game. Like, I genuinely love Survivor. But... It isn't insanely high quality, that's for sure. But even if you even if you replayed the game, you can replay this game four times. Or sorry. A normal playthrough of this is like two hours. And if you loved it, you can replay it and go a different route. If you <laughs> if you dare please to do that. I have to scratch, I have to scratch. How would I feel if they remade this? I'd feel if I think I'd be the most excited person on this planet if they remade this. I think everyone would just fucking flock here for the for the stream. I, I'm I'm the only one that yeah. I probably have the most stream time of Survivor of everybody on Twitch. I don't even I haven't even ran the game in like five years. Damn it. Thank you, Archives. Uh, he fell! Is this the game where the music fucks up? Yep, it's in the next area. Where it sounds like you're stuck in traffic. What time is it in PST right now? It's it's 2.40, right? Or, sorry, it's uh, 11.40? Or no, 10.40. 10.40, 10.40. All right, I will gift what subs we have now after Survivor and then I'll tally up the ones and Outbreak and gift those two. Diddle, 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 diddle
Here's the song. Sounds like you're stuff stuck in traffic. The music. Beep 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 beep. Get off the road. Here it comes. <laughs> Thank you, I hate that pair for the gifted sub. Here's the story. They are creating these monsters on this island. And there it goes. I unironically think this would make a great remake. Ah! Obviously they would vastly change the game, but I do think it would be good. An arc, arc, yeah. I like the sounds of that. Matt McGrump. Lot. Lot. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. What are you talking about? It's not your fault. Vincent is the one who caused everything. Well, I mean, I... You? What do you mean? You... You're the detective. Your name is Ark Thompson. What? What? Really? I'm not Vincent? Then why did you run away from me? Because I'm the one that told Vincent about you. Hello, I'm Vincent. I've been transferred to this facility to inspect it. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you, you, sir. I know Commander Vincent. So I knew that you weren't him when I saw you. What? A spy? Hmm. hmm. Thank you. You are a good boy, Lot. You are a good boy, Lot. You are a good boy, Lot. Good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, Lot. Good boy, good boy, good boy, Lot. So then I. The self destruction. For some reason, you can't skip that cutscene. This island will self destruct in 10 minutes. All the personnel must evacuate immediately. Listen, you can hear Ark go. Listen, listen, listen. Right here. Evacuate immediately. He didn't do it. What? He didn't do it. He usually does. He goes. I'm not kidding, by the way. No, it's no, that's no troll. That's right. At the request of my friend, Leon S. Kennedy, I came here to investigate. Oh, yes. I remember. I remember everything. His friend, Leon S. Kennedy, guys. 
tell me the truth. You are a spy, aren't you? Nice to meet you, sir. Vincent, I'm Ark, 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 Thank you, Matt McRump. Resident Evil. Ba -dum -ba 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 -dum -ba -dum. Gotta clean off the desk. Yeah. I can't believe you're not dead yet. You're human. <gasps> I can't believe you're not dead yet. You're human. You must be the leader of the cleaner unit sent by Umbrella to destroy the evidence of this biohazard. The writing. Whatever. I I don't have time for your pathetic games. I have already sent the self-destruction system. This island will be gone in a matter of minutes. Adios, Ark. Pepsi Man. Oh, this can't be. Man fire. You can fucking hear me, Jesus Christ. Yo, ba -ba 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 what is that? <laughs> just out of the corner of my eye, you just see the guy fucking ripping on it. Doesn't hit a single bullet. Yeah. 
Some people in the chat booted up Outbreak because we're playing online normal mode. Mister! Mister! <laughs> Ark is savage. Listen, you can hear Ark's golf ball brain bouncing around in his skull. fast. the magnum oops Survivor, everybody. The best game of all time, if I may. The best game of all time. Hurry! Hurry! All right, guys, here come the gifted subs. Are you ready? Are you ready? We still got one more game, but I'm gonna give them now because the detonation. Listen, fellas, Nine, the gifted sub eight, discount wears seven, off in one six, hour. Five, We're gonna gift them now, four, and then we'll give some more after outbreak. Who's ready? Who's ready? Safe. Hey, it can't be. 
Once we're out of fuel, kids, we're fucked. Enjoy the ride. Thank you. All right, people. Thank you, Corp. First come, first serve, baby. I'm playing online. Unless it doesn't log me in automatically. Then I'm playing offline. Please work, pup, 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 please work. Let's go! Yeah, Mario, come on, please work. Come on, it should say login is Bakwa Soup. Come on, baby, let's go! Come on! Come on, baby! <gasps> Woohoo! Dear, I just gotta. Once you change your game title to Outbreak, all the Outbreakers just flow in. It's like the bat signal. Watch. Outbreak. Alright, I changed it. Hey, hey, Outbreakers, welcome. Yeah, yeah, I am looking for some people. You, are you down? Fuck yeah, okay. Uh, so, uh, wait, where are they? Your furry animals here. All right, I'm opening up the lobby, guys. Normal mode, we usually play very hard, but I'm in a bit of a hurry. A hurry boy, if you may. Yeah, Parrot. Here, Parrot, this is for you. I said, have a good sleep. 
Guy, well, that's how you go fast. You play on normal. That's how you go fast. How many people are in this lobby? Happy October! Oh, shit! Look, guys! Oh! Oh, goodness gracious! Happy October, everybody! Woohoo! Thank you, Constantine! Oh, goodness gracious. That son of a gun actually did it. That son of a gun actually did it. Thank you, Isles. Thank you. All right, the lobby's open. If we can't get anybody, I'll just play offline, but a soup trooper. Okay, we got a soup trooper so far. Okay, we got some people. We got some people. Uh-huh. We got some people. One more, thank you, Constantine. Who for the stand out? Come on, one more, one more. Thank you, yo, dragon. We could start with three. Here, I'll use the bathroom really quick. And then, if it's still at three, we'll go with three. We got four. All right, gamers, let's go. Let's go, gamers. Let's go. Let's go, 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 go. Oh, he loves Outbreak. Buddy. Move out of the camera, I gotta watch. Oh my god, this team is my team is optimal. I I was the last person to press skip. Alright, let's do this, people. Help me, please! Yes. Help me, please! Dear God! All right, I got this, boys and girls. Fuck 
Fuck yeah, dude. I'm gonna turn it down a little because it's loud as shit. Oh my god. Alright, I turned it down. Is that good? Dear Let's go, god. people. What? Watch this. Help me, please! Help me, please! Yoko! Good. I am dog. Dodge! George! 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 Oh my god. George! I'm not sure what to do. Mark. George! George! Over there! George! No. I found it. George! All right, so let me fill people in that haven't watched Outbreak before. So this is an online game. It's it's just Resident Evil OG, like the OG trilogy online. That's basically it. Like that's how it plays, I mean. No. Um, and when you hear characters being like, oh, George, and like, help me please, that is other players pressing buttons on their controller telling you specific things. Um, but my favorite thing about this game is there's like 20 different voice actors and there's like they're not all in the game, but there is like 8,000 recorded lines for this game. It's actually fucking crazy. Like there's, there are so many unique lines in Outbreak. It's, it's nuts. Like I've never even heard all of them. I probably haven't even heard, heard half of them. That's a stretch, but. What now? But I like to just say, George, listen. George. George. I was thinking. George! I'm not sure what to do. George! Thank you. Uh huh. Can you ask Mark if he enjoyed uh, Resident Evil Death Island? Mark, did you enjoy Death Good. Island? All right. No, I asked, did you enjoy Death Island, the movie? Yeah. He did. Come on. Do you like RE3 Remake? Never. Come on, do you like RE3 Remake? No, I just had a thought. Okay, Jesus Christ, dude. What can we do? Possibly. Hold on! Don't need to take offense to it. Alright, come on. Tell us, do you like RE3 Remake? Sorry, bud. Sorry? All right. Do you think yeah. Outbreak should get a remake? All right. All right. Do you think Outbreak should get a remake? Good. Uh, okay, that's not a good answer. <clears throat> Stupid crows. All right, let's go, people. I hope my team kills the crows or someone might die here. Attention, everyone. All right, so here's a little something about this level, guys. We're gonna do a precise jump here to jump across to the other building. So you need to press your button at the right time. If you fail that button press and a crow hits you, then you're you're dead. I'm not going first. And look, they want me to go first. No, kill the crows and I'll go. All right, I guess I'll go first. They don't want to go first. The person that goes first is in the most danger. Thank God, thank God. Yeah, see, if I don't help her up, she could get hit by the crow and killed. Back to the main menu, I mean. Like, it's a one-hit kill. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Someone will make it. Yeah, look, Yoko did it. Come on! Yes. Yeah, say hi, YouTube. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, there's no enemy in here on normal. Bum. Bum, 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 bum. George! George! Where's wait, where is George? George! George? George! 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 No. Yes. George! There's George. Greetings, YouTube, and welcome to the stream. We would love to have you here from October, YouTube. Good, good. Mark. Hello, you two. Josh. How are you today? Have a look. Oh, it's October 1st. We gotta start playing Signalis. We gotta go now. 45 minutes left of September. We gotta go now. No. I gotta get this game done before the discount wears off. Quick! Soup troopers need subs. Hit the door. First boss, by the way, is a door. Yes, this is a boss fight. I'll distract the. Oh yeah, it's not. It's not. Oh my God! There's so many of them. No, no, give me that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, hey. ten, eleven, twelve. The block! This thing's never gonna break. Thank you so much. Dude, the guy keeps getting attacked. Oh my god. Leave him alone, damn it. Dude, can he die? I don't even know. But he's gonna, if he can. Jesus Christ, dude. George did just say you're worse than my ex-wife. All right, so I got to grab the lighter here. Well, one of us has to grab the lighter here. Oh, I just my first date. No, I didn't. Come on. I don't know where George went, but... Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I gotta light this on fire now. Burn all the zombies. Hey, hey. Boom, baby. Burnt to a crisp. Yeah, I love that, Rav. On Very Hard, that cutscene is uh, bugs instead, because you fight bugs on Very Hard, and they even change the FMV. Where's George? Where's George? Hey, 
Maybe we gotta turn it back up a little. One sec. George! Resident Evil Containment? Oh, the mod. Yep. George! George! God, Mark has a fat dumper. Look at that thing. Uh, Mark, is RE3 Remake RE2 Remake DLC? All right. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, he said. Mark, did you get your your Bakbasu plushie yet? Never. You at least like the design? Where's George? Wait, George, are you in the chat? Maybe George got DC'd. Oh, George is dead. This is the Raccoon City Police Department. Rest in peace, George. We love you. That's it then? Get in, please. Get in, please. The highway is too dangerous. Uh, brutal hand. That sucks. They were probably just like, oh man, this is the R3 remake. This is probably only worth like ten dollars. Let's leave it. Twenty-one rounds. Let's fucking go, baby. Yes. Come on. Is there no way to open this? Mark. Oh, we get to see the Mark cutscene. This is the best cutscene in the game, guys. Oh, that smell. That's an order I never want to experience again. Oh, that smell. That's an order I never want to experience again. That's an order I never want to experience again. Oh, that smell. I skipped on all the bites when fighting the door. Thank you. <laughs> GG, first level done, baby. Boing! That's, that's me gifting you guys subs. Except it doesn't hurt, it's just... Uh, you know. It's like, you get a sub, you get a sub. Same. I'm getting too old for this. Mm -hmm. Yo, thank you, 007. 
This was just a horrible situation from the start. Stop. But the battlefield is always there to deal with. And you must always fight to win. True. That was all I could think of at that time. Yesterday, just before dawn, the Pentagon announced that radioactive waste has been leaked throughout Raccoon City. In accordance with U.S. safety regulations, the city has been placed under quarantine and the army has been sent in to investigate and control the situation. Nuclear waste. And they send in the army? Um, I'm not actually sure, Frank, man. I think I get it as the months go on. Oh. All right, first come, first serve. Thank you for everyone who made it into that lobby. Thank you for playing. Let's make another one. Hazeblade, did you want to come? Bam. <laughs> I think Cindy may have taken the bad ending. Or I don't know if it kills you if you're not there for that, but. A low freezing point. All right, who should I be? I don't know who I got. I need to take a phase blade gun. I'm not gonna check my character. Haze blade. Haze blade, are you in the chat? He's not here. That's okay. Someone else can join. He might. He he's probably like fucking killing it. Shy girl, Jim B. Hi, oh, hi, shy girl. Oh, goodness. Hi, shy girl. Boom! Re oh, I thought I got Rita. Hunk B, baby, let's go. Shy girl, there's shy girl in the chat. Unga bunga, it's shy girl. Sorry, I'm only doing that because you are. Uh. Oh wait, here, let me talk to Shy Girl. You guys might not understand. Uh-huh. Uh. Uh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Freeze Buster! What? Did you find anything new? Uh. <laughs> Unga Bunga. Unga, uh. Hunk, this character is actually amazing. He's super fast and super strong. Alright, hopefully Shy Girl understood that. I told her what to do. You could never fool me. You know the main reason I want this to get remastered or remade? Is so people that haven't played but watch it on Twitch understand what's going on. Because it's actually so simple. But I feel like if you've never like right now, like half the chat's probably like, what the fuck is this? Like what is Jim doing? Like what is going on right now? Uh -huh. Did you find anything? Thank you, Lon Lon! Thank you so much. Oh, this is not a good spot to spawn. Or, well, it's fine. 
so in this level, so this is the RE2 lab. In this level, um, everyone spawns in a separate spot. Two people spawn upstairs, two people spawn downstairs. Oh good, Jim's doing the passwords. That's good. So I am a Kevin type character. In this game, there are classes, basically. The classes are Jim, Cindy, Mark, Kevin, whatever. Um, but this character is a Kevin type. And what that means is I have like super power pistol shots. So my pistol shots do like way more damage if I go like this. Or I can't do it with no ammo, but. And I also have a kick too. And that's Kevin's thing. He's he's and he's, he's usually fast as well. But the, my favorite thing about Outbreak, or one of my favorite things, and most of you know this already, every single solitary character, all like 80 of them, all have different statistics. So like Hunk B might be faster than Hunk A, but he's less tanky, you know, stuff like that. Oh, nice glasses. The merchant would love those. Come here. Give me those glasses, you motherfucker. Give me those glasses. Outbreak trying to give someone an item it reminds me of like my parents when I'm younger because yeah. I grew up with two brothers So they'd be like yo John Jacob uh, uh, Jeremy like they would never get the name right until the last one I'm trying to give someone an item. I'm, I'm like all right. I need to give this to Yoko Alyssa. Fuck Jim. Fuck Yoko. finally Huh But sometimes at Outbreak, you'll, you'll like try to say Yoko, Alyssa. but then Alyssa will hear, like Alyssa has quick reflexes and she'll just run up and try and grab it. Just like, no, 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 I meant Yoko, no, oh, fucking no. Cause you don't know, oh, you don't know, you don't know whose uh, name is which direction or I don't. So I always am just like, uh -huh. all right. Is that Siren professional outbreak player? Kevin. Outbreak your master. I know it's coming. I know Come it's on. coming. It's gotta be. Come on, Capcom, please. Kevin. Please, Capcom. I'm begging you. Come on. Right. No, you can have the first aid spray. Excellent. Hey, Kevin, do you like RE3 Remake? No. Not even a little? No way. Do you like RE2 Remake? Uh-huh. RE1 yes. Remake? Uh-huh. Is $10 too expensive for separate ways? No. There you have it, folks. Oh, Dark Rick! Good. Dark Rick. Excellent. Good. Dark Rick. Thanks. For the resub. <laughs> is okay, Kevin. Is OGRE four better than remake? No. Kevin. Uh huh. Kevin. 
take this. Excellent. Excellent. Is RE4 Remake soulless, Kevin? Yes. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. The plot thickens. Don't move a muscle, broski. I think Yoko is going to go handle the mission. Watch this. I'm gonna, gonna put the control on my desk. Let's see how fast we can press this button. You ready? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. One sec. Sorry. There. All right, you guys ready for this? How fast can we press it? Ready? Here we go. Here we go. Woo! Good. Move it. Yes. Hurricane Chris, who's playing Outbreak without me, he's thinking. Hey, bitch boy, think fast. Uh. Got him. Got him. Got him. Here. Here. The hunter models in this are scary. Oh my god. Come on. So if you guys don't know, hunters have a one shot in this game, regardless of health. They go up, they're like, Rah! it's not like the OGs where they dive across the screen. They have like this this like supercharged attack. Hey, hey. Listen. Listen. Where they just go like this. Hey there. Rah! Rah! And then you're dead. Exclamation mark schedule Ivy. Alyssa, where's Alyssa? Alyssa, are you in trouble? Are you in the chat? Alyssa, are you in trouble? Alyssa. Alyssa, are you okay? Alyssa. Are you in the chat? Alyssa. 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 There she is. She's coming. Alyssa. 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 
We gotta go save Alyssa. I'm coming, Alyssa. Coming, honey. Alyssa, you out here? Thank you so much. Survival is my responsibility. Oh shit. We got a whole troop of them. Alyssa. Alyssa. Thank you so much. Stop wasting shotgun ammo. Well, shit. Wow. Yeah. You do camp here the whole time and wait Alyssa. at the timer. Good. And that might seem stupid to some people. But man, when you're like first playing this online, like you don't know anything, sometimes you make it to that platform with like seconds to spare, or you miss it and die. We gotta watch this. Oh, this is after one spoonful of the um, bee pollen that I eat. One spoonful. This is how many nutrients it has. McDonald's Sprite. Oh, it's the McDonald's dollar menu. Hey! Alright, watch this, people. Blast some skater. Oh yeah, we're on normal mode. This guy's gonna drop fucking dead. Something tells me the people I'm playing with can probably handle very hard. I feel like the worst person in the lobby. I have a bad habit of embellishing stories, but I don't need to do it this time. At present, Raccoon City is one giant freak show. Giant freak show. Yeah, Shy Girl's fucking cracked. Huh. Her, is Hurricane Hurricane Chris have you logged on? Alright, well, so I'm gonna make a new lobby, but if you've played one already, just hold back for like a minute or so. Um and see if anyone new wants to play. Maybe I think Hazeblade wants to play and uh maybe Hurricane Chris, but huh. Alright, we'll get both of you guys in there. Are you here, Hazeblade? Huh. Soup. He's logging in now. All right, we'll wait for you. Tell me when you're ready. Soupy doopy. Doopy 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 Hmm 
Lloyd, I'll take it. Wait, what's the turbo button? What, what's the turbo button on the keyboard? F5? It used to be tab for me, but it's not anymore. Oh, it says frame turbo enabled. Thank you, Snowy. Yeah, we'll do very hard. It's fine. No, just file one. Mm. All right. So I'm just waiting for Hazeblade and Hurricane Chris. Because I know they want to do one. And then last slot. Last slot. Is oi 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 oi. Well, who's, what's your guys' favorite game of the marathon so far today? Now some of you have been here the entire stream. Crazy, crazy people. Outbreak. Outbreak? We just started Outbreak. Are you one? That was a, that was a slobber knocker. The one with Freddie Mercury. RE2 Remake. I like Resident Evil one, two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one remake, and two remake, and Code Veronica. I like Survivor 2 and Dead Aims Poo. Do -do 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 -do. Haze Blade, the Hazer. Toxic Avenger Remake. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm just talking about mainline games, not DLC. Do I think I have enough YouTube channels? No, I need to make some more. He forgets his password. Hey, all right, this level takes like five minutes. It's okay. We'll just do it and then. Amelia it is. You know, Nanners. Sweet dreams, Nanners. Is Chris in here? Alright, I'm gonna disband if Chris doesn't make it. There's Chris. Cha girl, huh? Do do do, do do do, do 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 do. Uh, yeah, tuck, tuck them in. If anyone goes to bed, guys, remember to tuck them in. I need. I need to get all my better Twitch TV emotes bockified. I need to get them as chickens, like Tuck. Help! Help! 
Oh. Oh. I apologize. Have you found Siren? Yeah. You. Please do not be alarmed. Not be alarmed. I'm a doctor in this hospital. I must say that this hospital in the is not remake, he's gonna say to he's a cockter. It's not as safe as it may look. Or sound. A doctor that specializes in peepees. As soon as possible. What? Is, so gynecologists, you know, they do their thing. What is one for Where? for wieners? Oh my God, the David. Where? Yes. Is that a coctologist or what's it called? David. Did you find anything? Jim. Is there a name for it? A urol? Wait, is it a ur? No, is it a urologist? Yes. I gotta see a urologist. Go oh. Oh. The bloody elevator isn't working. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out why. It seems the I like how the personality they the gave this guy just revolves around background. him being surprised when he sees you. Oh. See if this works. Oh. Yeah, I like Coctologist. Is a woman allowed to be a urologist and a man's allowed to be a gynecologist, right? Just checking. I don't know. I've never seen a gynecologist, okay? Wait. Oh, I got stuck in the cutscene. Everyone else is already long gone. I was wondering why no one skipped that. Yes, sir, Siren, sir. Why are we talking about this? Um. Yeah, I forget. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, Chris. Now, okay, come in here and give me the blood. He's giving me the blood so I can do this part. All right, where is he? All right. No. Right. Check it out. Here, take this. Oh, handgun. I'll take it. Take this. Here. <laughs> what? Dude, this fucking lobby is flying through this level. Like, this is a speed run. Check it out. Here. Dooleys? I got dooleys. Yes. What if you could use dualies? In the remake, you might be able to. Thank you so much. I talk about Outbreak Remake like it's guaranteed. Oh, I'm sorry that I bring it up often, Jim, but Jesus Christ, dude. I told you, Mark, David, and then Jim. Okay. Don't give up. Don't give up. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Did you find it? Did you find anything? There nothing useful? Never. Mark. Jim. <laughs> Did you meet anyone? Jim. 
Jim, talk to me. <sighs> Jim. Jim. Watch, I'm holding yes? the door closed. Let's just try to stay <laughs> calm. It's better than nothing. No! Listen to me! This won't work. What? It's better than nothing. <laughs> it's better than nothing. No. won't work. No shit. <laughs> yes? It's better than nothing. Oh, hey. This yes? <laughs> Mark. No shit. Ah! Hey! Please help! Did you find it? No. Alright, let's roll. Hey. Yoko. Yeah. Thank you. David. Where's David? David. 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 Yoko. He's bugged out on the second floor. All right. David. Yes. David. David. Watch out. Yes. Watch out. David. Mark. Good. David. Find anything new? David. Oh, you're David. You're back on the second floor. We All right. Nothing. That's okay. We got nothing. I didn't see that before. Uh -huh. Oh. Bye. Sugar. Sugary boogeries, Raven. Sugary boogeries. We will fight for your honor, David. Satoshi David. Here, next lobby can be me, Satoshi, and, uh, well, Hazeblade's gotta get in. Oh, shit! Yoko. Ow! Wait, this is on very hard. I loved it, Alt! I loved it! It was fucking poggers! I just spit all over the camera.
Oh my god, that's so weird. All I could do was run about trying to escape. I'm ashamed of surviving like this. And I feel I've forgotten something very important. But why? Perhaps the answer lies ahead. Ooh, it's a area one, yeah. To be continued, baby. To be continued. <gasps> Rank S! Yes! All right, we need the hazer in the next lobby. The hazer. Guys, imagine when Outbreak's on Steam. We're going to be like, yo, chat, who wants to play? And everyone's going to be like, double click, double click, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm going to have to start auctioning off spots of the lobbies. Auctions. No? Er, never mind. Octology. <coughs> ben, you must be Ben. Right? Get up! Now! Coctology is the study of chickens. Boom, baby! Coctology means you're studying a chicken. Let's -a go! Haze! The Hazer, everybody! Character Jim! All right, the lobby's open to all now. The lobby's open to all. Come on in, everyone. Shy girl, <laughs> who's last? The Hazer. Oh, wait, someone joined and left instantly. Thank you, Cold Kolska. For the gifted sub, let's go. For the gifted sub, let's go. For the gifted sub, let's go. <laughs> the gifted sub, let's go. Chris! Oh, Raven gave you the go-ahead. Alright then. Alright then. Yeah, you guys are doing God's work. Oh, man. Outbreak. Oh, outbreak. 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 I'm about to have an acne outbreak from all the stress I get from thinking that Capcom hates Outbreak. Oh my god, Bulbasaur. I am actually an expert in coctology and, um... One second, this is actually an emergency. This shit ain't right. I think I might be stuck in the. <coughs> Never mind. Jeez, what's going on? <laughs> Jeez. Come on. Help. Help. What Where's that liquor? Hey. Hey. Hey, you. Huh? What? No shit. No shit. Ah, uh, press F9. Don't come any closer. Well, if you have it set up properly, press F9. Thank you, God, Davis. Thank you. The dodge. Oh. 
Thank God they know how to do this level. I hate Hellfire. Oops. This is the only level in the whole... You know what? I don't hate this level. I don't hate this level. I love this level. It's Outbreak. Yeah. Is that actually Ben? One sec. Let's ask him. Are you actually Ben from RE2? Yeah. Do you like RE3 Remake? No. Like that was- like it was a pathetic question. <laughs> Jeez. Do you think Ben and RE2 Remake is better than Ben and RE2 Original? No. All right. We can't make it. Are you yeah. an expert in coctology, uh, Ben? Yes. You sure about that? Good. Holy moly. Why? Then help me out. This sucks. I don't know. I think so. Did you find anything? Here's what I'm thinking. No. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Come here. All right, I'm going to do an insane puzzle, which I only know how to do it fast if it gives me the RNG, the only RNG I know. Which, that wasn't it. Wait. No, that definitely wasn't it. But I got this. Watch. Okay. And... Three, two, one. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Mama Mia. Pizzeria. Uh-oh, they're gonna come in here and do it before I can. I don't like the sounds of that. Don't you dare. What is, what is it? What What is this RNG? David! David! Right. <laughs> I, I only know one. That's not it. David. David. Let's go. Actually, I better get the, I'm going to get that battery. Oh, I've played like I understand the puzzle completely, but um, I just don't know the smallest amount of move. You could solve in like three button presses or the four or something. <laughs> Liquors these days. David. Yes. Yeah. Good. Good. Liquors don't lick. Liquors don't lick. No problem, Hyper. Let's go, Sandy. Come on, babe. Thank you so much. Come on, babe. Yeah. Yeah. Liquors don't lick. Here. 
Right. I have a key. All these shotgun shells, but no shotgun. Alright, here we go. Help! Oh, I got hit by a zombie. Ah! Find anything. Yeah, this level's fast. The next level, however, is not fast. Human centipede. All right, I'm going to be ringing this bell. It's not stream friendly, but guys, just try and listen to it. Listening. Getting incredibly anxious. What? You don't like this? So I'm not doing it to be annoying. It's because it messes up the liquor's AI. Her down. We're saved. You made it. Get out. Her. Her. Come on. Dude, can you stop with the spam? Don't, don't. It's not just the hotel. Now the whole city is burning. The whole fucking. The whole city. We're lucky. You helped. We've been patrolling the city, trying to help those in need, but it's worse than a war zone. The army's been called in. Better get out of the city while you can. I have a very bad feeling. Oh, joy. So I escaped from the fire. Doesn't change anything. I'm still in the city of wriggling dead bodies, forced to listen to their moans. When is this stupid game gonna end? Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. When is this stupid game gonna end? S rank! By the way, the reason this is best is because my actual save data got deleted like a year ago. I had hundreds of hours in this game on my profile and they all got deleted. Feels bad, man. Now how many hours do I have? 25. I had like, it was like I think it was like 280 on my other account. Or like two, 200 something. I think. I can't really remember now. I know I had 200 on file two. Maybe not file one though. All right. I'm making another lobby. Where's the bee? La bala. Lobologist.
All right. Is this the crew? Oh. Hurricane Chris is fucking rattled. Ugh. Thank you, JX Jab. That's correct. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you, Jab. Woohoo! Yeah, let's go. All right. Too much growth weakens the organization. Mass production? Ridiculous. Too much growth weakens. Don't, no, no, don't watch it. You guys would have cringed. I don't want you to cringe when watching this channel. But that's never this happened. Place too. Wait. What? what? Dear George. Dear George, I have vital information about the current. Have you guys ever cringed while watching the channel? Ones, if so. I'm waiting at the university. Twos, if not. Oh. Mamma mia! You just cringe? I know how to make Cammy cringe. Watch this. Boy, what's the password to this? Does anyone know? I can't remember. I got a pipe. Look at everyone in the 250. They're popping in. You know what, guys? Because you answered that so quick. Oh my god, and okay, when when we were first talking about cocktology, Angie in the chat was like, what the fuck are you guys talking about? Shut the fuck up. And now Angie's all about the cocktology. Fall down, you asshole! Oh, oh. Ah! Fall down! <laughs> ah! Look at this, look at this. Yeah, I'm gonna get myself killed by fucking around too hard. Look at how tanky zombies are and very hard. Finally, dude. Please help. Help. help! 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 She's not dead. Come on! I need help. Please help! 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 Help me, please! Help! Help me, please! Please help! Someone, for the love of God, help me! Oh, now you'd fucking piece of shit. Kevin. <sighs> hey. Yes. Alyssa. <laughs> this is it. No. Yeah. No idea. Uh-huh. Move! Kevin! Yes. Kevin! Here's what I'm thinking. Jim is here to help. Uh-oh, it's her. She's back! She's back from the dead again! Help! Cindy! Yeah. Cindy! Kevin! Wait! Good. Thank you. Excellent. The Excellent. whole crew came to help, guys. Thank you. For the soup troop crew. Thank you. Did you find anything? Kevin. Save the stream. <laughs> 60 seconds into the match. The streamer needs our help. <laughs> First zo <laughs> First zombie. Help! Help! <laughs> Huh. 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 Ah! 
Shit! I'm gonna need all this. What else we got cracking over here? I'm going to B2 as well. Or I'm going to the bottom one. B4 or whatever it is. I'm not comfortable. Oh, God. I don't know if I'll be able to choose my floor. Oh, I'm not going there. Someone else can go to the pier. Break be a mainstream success if released today. If it was remade, maybe. Remaster? No. But it would do very well. If this game was remastered, it'd be one of the few games that has been remastered over the course of the Earth. I don't know. I don't know how remastered games do, like Spyro and stuff. I don't know if they out outsold their original. Or anything like that, but Outbreak, if re released, would completely dominate its original release without fucking question. There's no, no doubt. There's three of us here. Excuse me. Thank God Shy Girl is a professional. Yo, Andy. Are you do you love outbreak? Alright, come on. The thing's too huge. These nine millimeters are useless. Uh, I've never wanted to be a cocktailist more than right now. Calm down. You must give me your blood. Just do it. Yeah, Capcom. Just do it. Let's do it, Capcom. You want them to do it, David? Uh-huh. You can't even though you're Kevin. Hey. What the hell is that? That's a that's a hornet. So, you're probably thinking, is Bach gonna nail this upcoming puzzle? I only know one of the RNGs. Did you find it? But man, if it's that RNG, I'm gonna fucking destroy it. No, Jim, 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 Jim's gonna do it. Jim, don't you, Jim is gonna steal my thunder. Thank you, Derek. Oh, wait. Kevin. Jim? Right now, Cindy. Okay. Uh, this this isn't Kevin? it, but I think I got this. Watch this. Alyssa. Okay. Nada. No. Sorry. All right. It, pay attention. Sorry. Pay close attention to this next part. Kevin. Kevin. Uh huh. Kevin. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Uh huh. Just do it! <laughs> 
Jim? Wait, wait. Wait a minute. Just do it. Jim. Alice. Alice. I'm playing online right now, Zen. My favorite enemy in the Resident Evil franchise. Ribbit. Look at this fuck boy. Rita. Jim. Little bit of Rita is all I need. Little bit of. Thanks. All right, here I go. Little bit of George all night long. Cindy. Jim. And I'm up. No problem. Ionis. A little bit of Jim. All night long. A little bit of Alyssa. In the sun. A little bit of Cindy. Here I am. A lot of Jim. In the sun, a lot of Jim all night long, a lot of Jim everywhere. Jim at work, Jim at school, Jim don't care. Where is everybody? Jim, yes, Jim, uh huh, Jim, uh huh, uh huh. Outbreak number five, yeah, Jim. Where is it? <laughs> hey guys, are you coming? Jim. 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 I'm scared. I wonder if they're He's down. I know what you guys are thinking. Thank you so much, Jim. Give me a minute, Jim. Cindy's never died. Come on, Jim. Jim. Just do it. Jim. Imagine this on the RE engine. It'd be like Navisadors. Hey, hey. Yes. So, have you seen anyone? I know that. This place is the bee's knees. my last heal. Thank you. Yeah, you guys can get the thing. I'm going to get health. Yeah. You know what is fun? Like a sham sham a lamb? That is one of the most common things said about Outbreak. But the funniest thing about Outbreak it's people think it's so complicated, but it's so simple. It's literally just Resident Evil online. That is it. There's no other there's no like bells and whistles. 
That's what it is. Just do it. Mm. There's a lot of jank surrounding it, but but that is all it is. Yeah, then you have the virus and the bleed. The vi I think I think what what deters people from understanding the game is the virus, which doesn't matter really unless you're brand new to the game. And then the the talking. Jim. Kevin. Yes. Oh yeah, this is so there's always the discussion of like oh, no. hardest Resident Evil game. Like, oh, it's, is it zero? Is it CVX? You know, it's Outbreak. Like, it's not even a question. It's Outbreak, 100%. Yeah. Outbreak is the hardest Resident Evil game of all the Resident Evil games ever. Oh, we didn't do this yet. Like, I've seen many people try and play this, like, do a story playthrough of Outbreak on Twitch. And every time, like, they just get fucking wrecked for days. Unless someone tells them what to do, or they play with another person online that knows what to do. Like, if they're trying to figure it out all by themselves, it's like, it's like torture. I remember watching, uh, Larksa play this, and, like, Larksa's never had a lot of trouble with an RE game. And this took her many streams. Thank you so much. Like this level especially, this level is fucking difficult. I was gonna sing the whole song in that death voice, but I didn't want everyone to leave. What's up? Oh, and uh, I mean, yeah, but outbreaks also just, but that that just ties in with how hard it is. You are on a timer. Like, the virus gauge makes it so you're on a timer. And I know a few people that have said they don't like this game because of the virus. But, like, once you play through it once, the virus doesn't really matter. Like, the amount of times I've died from virus is very, very, very low. Or There's a difference between, like, dying to your virus going up and getting knocked down and sitting there on the floor. But, like, dying to your actual, like, timer running out is super rare. Highest infection rate, like the worst virus in the game, is Mr. Green. Just do it. Who, Mr. Green? So every time you get hit, um, fall down, which uh, hey, basically every time you get hit, your virus gauge goes up. Okay, and Mr. Green. Without getting hit, has I think it's what's 42 minutes or something or 45 minutes to <laughs> to beat the level or you're you're a zombie and that's without taking any damage. That's with a perfect virus. Thank you so much. But there is antivirus you could take and it stops it for a while. Like like that. Thank you, mover. <sighs> Hmm. What? Uh, Why now? No way. Yeah. Just do it. Just do it. Cindy, do you need Just our help? Do it. Yeah. Oh, last trials. I was saying that when playing last trials. It is very similar to this game. Like it's a similar kind of game. They don't play the exact same or anything like that, but the idea behind it is similar. <laughs> 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 
Thank you, Rated R Riri, for the 36. Did I finish Outbreak online? Offline? Um, I mean, I have on stream, but I don't think I did as a kid. I, by the way, I played this game when it came out on PS2 with an Ethernet connection with the modem attached to my PS2 because my brother, my oldest brother had all of it. And so I got to play it like when it was online. Um, I was fucking terrible at it. That's all I remember. Like my only memories of Outbreak when it first came out were were getting lost and losing my teammates and like refinding them and still not beating the level and stuff like that. Uh... Oh, I know. I felt so lucky back in the day that my oldest brother had a PS2 with a modem. Um, cause I got to play Final Fantasy XI on it, uh, Champions of Norath, SOCOM 2, um, Outbreak. And then I loved those games so much that, uh, I saved up money and got a, a modem for my GameCube to play Fancy Star Online. And only Fancy Star. I didn't even, I didn't even know if there was another single online game for, for GameCube. And the funny thing was, Fancy Star Online not only required a modem and an ethernet connection, high speed internet, and you had to pay monthly for it. It was like $15 a month. Hi. And it was, it was a more, and on top of that, it was a more than full price game because in America, or I don't know about where you guys live, but Fantasy Star Online was fucking rare. So if you found it at any game store, it was super expensive. My apologies. My apologies for this play Farewell. Sloppy! No, I've only well, I only played Fantasy Star Online episode one, two, and three. Almost time. And I had a ton of playtime in three as well, like the card game. Yeah, I've beaten the game when I was a kid, 16. Um, but I couldn't get it to work. Uh, or I kept crashing like a few minutes in every time. All right, so right here, you're building the serum to the um, to the T-virus um, called Daylight. And if you take it, this is something cool about this level. Um, if you take it, it completes it completely gets rid of your virus so in this game there are three endings per character or not three per character some of them only have one or, or two sorry uh but there's a bad ending that you share with another character so like my bad ending i share with uh who am i I'm kevin i share a bad ending with jim and then if you take a daylight you get normal ending and if you take a daylight and are holding a daylight, you get best ending. And that's for every single character. Is that Mario Mayhem? Cause it's a fucking trouble. This is effing nuts. Okay. Yes. Mario wants to be an outbreak pro? 
I like the sounds of that. Yeah, Untouchable Gamer. Yeah, exactly. And that's why this game is so good. If you're a completionist, man, there's three endings per character. Every single character in every single level has different cutscenes. And you can't get all the cutscenes in a single playthrough of every single level. So, like, there's so much to be milked out of this game. Like, this game has so much fucking content, it's, it's ridiculous. Welcome. You're a selection of good things on sale, stranger. just found out this morning that my student loans are forgiven. So, it goes without saying I gotta share the love with the chicken man. Thank you for the $20 Eno's keeping life. Thank you, thank you. W, W's in the chat. W, student loans are forgiven? W. Thank you. The big W. Thank you so much, Keeping Light. Really appreciate the insane generosity. Thank you again, Puggles and Riri. We're almost done, guys. We're almost done. W. <laughs> Look, I'm a, I'm a W streamer now. I find it funny that there's a whole side of Twitch that's their chat, like big streamers' chats are just simply W and L. Even see him. Nice lag, dude. Thank you very much. You're a pogger, same. Over there. <laughs> I thought he was gonna shock me. Oh, I guess he tried. That good old Yeah, man. That's why I want Capcom to revisit Airbrick. Well, many reasons, but the lag, getting rid of the lag would be nice. Not that, well, Capcom probably wouldn't. It'd probably run horribly, but. Just do it. Just do it. Jim! Jim? 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 Get up, Jim. Jim, get up. Jim, just this heaven. Jim, heaven. Jim, just heaven. Jim, heaven. Just do it. Heaven. Just do it. Jim. Thanks. Jim, just do it. Jim died. I don't know what actually happened to Jim. Look at the view, guys. Raccoon City. The thing I want to see the most in Resident Evil, and I was hoping for this with RE3, I just want to see an, just a bunch of us Raccoon City. Just like Outbreak, I love seeing the different places in Raccoon City. 
Like the zoo and the hospital, the apartments, the university. Like, I love all that shit. And it's just good old fashioned zombies and, and other, like, normal, or like other classic bioweapons. I would love that. Run! Oh! Here, let me help you. It said don't be sloppy. Thank you, keeping life with the gifted sub as well. And uh, thank you, Mr. Rose. Hope you're doing well. Do you like Outbreak? Hey. Oh, re that will be Resident Evil 9. Rebuilt. Hey. I said that a while ago. I want. Oh, I wouldn't be surprised if they did like a... Uh, Like, oh, Raccoon City's been rebuilt and they're working on a new virus, yada, yada, yada. So what she's doing is she's opening up the rocket launcher crate before the boss fight starts. And there it is. Yes. That'd be cool. Oh shit. I'm not room master, so I shouldn't shoot this. Let's go. You know, I'll, I'll give it a whirl. I'll give it a whirl. How about I give it a whirl? Okay, come on, bruh. I knew it. If you're not room master, he teleports around. GG everyone, thank you so much for watching the marathon. Um, I want to thank the chat um, Just for like being here and and you know just chilling and I want to thank the soup troopers in the chat for You know all the gifted subs the follows the The chatting the And and Mbakpa Soup, the, the chicken plush. You know, you've been doing such a good job. Just um just being chill. This is it, soldier! Move out and draw fire, soldier. <laughs> well, I can daylight him. Yo, but is that? Yo, yo, but, but is that? Yeah, baby! G-Jizzler, everyone. G-Jizzlers. G-Jizzlers, everybody. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. G-Jizzlers. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Th th thank you. Ooh, 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 ooh. Thank you. Who, 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 hey, who, 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 hey, who, who. Yeah, 
Yo, what is? Yo, what is that? Huh? Yes, yeah, shy girl. Huh? Jim will be missed. All right, we get to see my extra special ending now. That's his coctology degree. Well, what should I do with the rest of my life? I'll think about it after I take a nap. There you go, everybody. There you go, little ones. Enjoy the gift itself, my little ones. Enjoy the gift itself. Oh, thank you for watching, though, everyone. Thank you for joining out in the marathon. Resident Evil 1, remake, 2, 2 remake, 3. Code Veronica, Survivor, and Outbreak all in a row. 85758. Um, when I've been actually streaming for 10 hours and 15 minutes. I know just who to raid though, everybody. So, October starts tomorrow. October starts tomorrow, everyone. There's still a few emotes to be added. There's still a few e animations getting worked on. This is the merch right now. I may release a plush at a, a, a week or so in, or I may release a shirt design a week or so into October. Um, we will see. Uh, but tomorrow it begins. I'll be playing Signalis. I think other games this week I'd like to play. Maybe Haunted Ground Clock Tower 3. I will update the schedule tomorrow. Um, 